Yo, what's up? My people. You are watching Shoji Plays Animal Crossing on YouTube. And we about to get lit. You feel me? New Horizons is coming out uh, in a few hours. Um, Alright, let's get it. Need to go out in town, Bapu. 10.38 a.m. Um, okay. Let's go. New Horizons is coming out today, yo. That is crazy. Yo, Steffi, do you hear me? <laughs> okay, well, anyway. <sighs> Let's get going. Here we go. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm Right, here we go. That's life. So yesterday, um, had a pretty good day. We uh, drew a lot, a lot of different patterns. Got some more. Uh, oh snap, that was not There you go. Um, yeah, that's Okay, so I finished that survey. Oh, hey, I'm live streaming and right like... now, by the way. Uh -oh. Yeah. <laughs> hey. hey, we doing it live. But what happened with your survey? It was gonna be about knives. Oh my god. <laughs> That's and so like weird. apparently like the survey was like too full, so like it was like never mind, we don't <laughs> Really? Okay. Yeah. So funny. Alright. Yeah. And take a look at my the presents I got today. Oh, it's a fossil. Nice. I got fossil. Did I even read it? Uh, T Rex. Cool. Yo, Eddie, where they at, though? Did it work? Yeah, it's on. <laughs> <laughs> Did it work, though? Yeah, where's where's Billy? He said he didn't want to do it. Wow. Why? He said he got mad at us. Again? Just like every day? Yeah. <laughs> oh, well. It's whatever. What's he up to though? <laughs> Do you know what Billy is doing? Oh, you what? Do you know what Billy's doing? Oh, <laughs> uh, I think he's in his room. He's gonna join. Oh, that's what's up. <laughs> um, is nice. Steffi listening to this? Yeah, yes, yeah, Steffi's here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm like trying to do surveys. <laughs> surveys? Yeah, she's yeah, trying to make some to money. money. <laughs> uh like I don't know, they're kinda Ooh, I don't know how the whack they were. Yeah, they're pretty whack. Surveys whack. Billy whack. Yeah, Ooh. they're whack because like you have to like answer all these questions before you even get to take the actual survey and get money, and if they feel as though that, like, you're not really the kind of people who are looking for, they you. Yeah, actually, I don't know if you're seeing the, the live stream, but, um, it's raining outside and all the characters have cute little, like, umbrellas. <gasps> no, I don't see that. Are you watching it? 
I thought I was. Never mind, wait, hold on. <laughs> Are you watching like an old one or something? No, I don't know what I was looking at. <laughs> it doesn't matter to you that it's porn, buddy. Oh, yeah. oh I see. Yeah. <laughs> Aww. They all got little umbrellas. I got a little pink checkered umbrella. Dora. Dora borrowed my watch and won't give it back. I ought to give that fool the old Bama. I'm sick of dealing with it, so I want you to go to Dora's place and get it back, okay? Fine. I will handle it. It's the errand. <laughs> Yo, Ashley. Oh, Billy's here. Ashley. Yeah, you are. They're, they're asking me in the survey to indicate the name of my cats below. What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> I That's don't know. So, well, the, you could just lie. Just be like, like oh, your, your cat's name is Little Kitty. Never mind. <laughs> your cat's name is Little Kitty? Uh, well, actually, you, we don't want you to do this survey an, an, anymore. What survey are you taking? Are you taking a survey? I'm just trying to make money online. <laughs> and I'm discovering how. The, I don't know. I've tried all of those web those survey websites so many times. Yeah. They suck. Yeah, they're pretty bad. This is the first time I've tried using them. This is gonna be this is gonna be the last survey I going to take for as of today. <laughs> oh Mallory has a, a sunflower umbrella. Oh, that's so cute. Nice. I started my mascot game. <laughs> hey, turn <laughs> oh on. Oh my god, Ashley. Oh, hold on, I'm so sorry. I have a question that says, What percentage of time does each of your cats use an indoor litter box? <laughs> this is Little Kitty. What? 1 what? to 24%. Mona Lisa. Hold on, I'm gonna like screenshot this. <laughs> That's so specific. Like, how do you even calculate that? Yeah, I don't know. Mm. You guys hear any echo in my end? Um, no. no. No, there's no echo, but it just sounds a little grainy, but like just a tiny bit. Grainy? Yeah, it sounds like a little tiny, like grainy. Do I sound clear? Yeah, 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 it actually sounds fun. Um, I gave Ashley some, some really good ideas for mascots. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh my god, I'm scared. Once you finish it, we gotta present it on the live stream. <laughs> Gladly. Damn, that's what's up. <laughs> At first, I was just thinking of having them all do heroin. Oh my god. really convinced me that they should do all types of drugs. <laughs> like, oh yeah, drugs. yeah, that would be kind of interesting. <laughs> you would see a whole bunch of like different characters. Like they all have different preferences. <laughs> so many voices. A Krista Ba just is uh, chatting in the in the YouTube chat. Oh <laughs> hey. That's what's up. He's watching. He do be watching though. Uh, hey Chris, if you're watching, I'm gonna send you something on Instagram right now. Okay. Um, I sent you a link to the Discord. So if you want to join Discord, then you can uh, go on the voice chat and you'll be able to talk to us from your phone. So you know, it's some fancy new technology that we got here. Chris said, hi Steffi and and Roldy Suave. <laughs> Damn. He said, incredible. How, how Amazing. Are, what are you doing right now, Dubois? Oh, let's see what he says. Yeah. Uh, we so lit. Dab like this. Uh, the day the remaining pieces are research puzzle. So I'm just gonna donate some. Yo, Chris, do you have a switch? You probably don't. Um, 
A uh, Chris said, I'm in my workshop chilling. Typical late night. <laughs> no switch. That yeah, that sounds I'm gonna pretty peaceful. Send a screenshot of, uh, of this whole like cat litter thing. How oh does that make any sense? You should put it on the Discord. Yeah, hold on. <laughs> I always catch a little kitty taking a dump more than Mona. <laughs> okay, it's because she's so chunky. Sometimes I'm. It says, what percentage of time does each of your cats use an indoor litter box? <laughs> they like want you that time. <laughs> I'm like, little kitty uses the litter box for one thing or so. Steffi and Billy and Ashley. Animal Crossing. <gasps> Is that Allie? Yeah, it's Allie. Yeah. You should, you should give Allie a mic. Alright, here, I'll, I'll put it Wait, on. Wait, Allie, what's your favorite mascot? Wait, here. <laughs> Say it again, Ashley. Yo, yo, yo. Ask Allie what her favorite mascot <laughs> is. Hmm. Oh, what mascots are there? <laughs> like, cereal, There's food, many types. like, anything. Like, Companies, you know, like, like Buzz Lady like cereal from... mascots. Oh, uh, hmm. That's a good question. Hmm. Alka Seltzer. Alka Seltzer is it? Yeah, they had a mascot. Oh. But not it any. It looks like Billy. Huh, this is hard. <laughs> mm. Like, you could be like anything. Favorite? Mm -hmm. mm. I have so many fair. I love mascots. I'm like obsessed. Whoa. Are you those uh, people that dress up in, <laughs> in mascots? <laughs> yeah, actually. Sure furry? A oh, furry? no, those are furries. Those are, those are a different kind of people. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Um, this is hard. Um, mm. Like, I like Mr. Peanut. Mr. Peanut? Peanut? No, that's who she oh, is. Yeah. Ashley, like. <laughs> I, I really like the Domino's mask. But, like... He's dead. Does Club Yo, Penguin actually, count? Not really, they don't. It's like of a company. Yeah. I mean, you like Mickey, right? Yeah, but he's not my favorite. Mm. I guess Bugs Bunny is kind of. I like Bags Bunny. <laughs> Bags. <laughs> I like bags, Bunny. <laughs> <laughs> like, mm. no, um, you ever heard of Big Chungus? Huh? huh? You ever heard of Big Chungus? No. You should look him up. <laughs> yeah, you should look up Big he's, Chungus. He's a uh, Bugs Bunny. <laughs> oh. Uh, no, he's not my favorite. I don't know. This is hard, <laughs> man. <laughs> think about it and come back. Yeah, please. I'm gonna think about it and I'm gonna come back. <laughs> Yeah, but my big chunk is sweet. And so what happened? <laughs> Alex says Bugs Bunny isn't her favorite mascot. <laughs> Bugs Bunny. Yo, her, her, you should show uh, Big Chungus to Brandon. Oh, yeah. I feel like he's probably seen it. <laughs> big he's like, Chungus. He's, so he's like, oh, yeah, I love Big Chungus. <laughs> Here he comes. <laughs> Doesn't he have like Bugs Bunny on his car? Yeah. He's a big Bugs Bunny fan. Oh, I got money. He has Bugs Bunny on the seats. <laughs> Dude, I just got a whole bunch of free money from this rock. Sometimes. Yeah, right? Oh my god. Billy would go crazy. Get out of the I'll kill you. <laughs> I, I just um released a butterfly. Oops. oops. Really, hey, say butterfly in Spanish. Ooh, let's see, oh, maricon. Wait, no, <laughs> wait, did you just say it? I said maricon. That's mariposa, right? No, yeah. it's maricon. <laughs> 
What do you think? It's funny? So you thought I was fucking stupid. Yeah. To be honest. If I'm gonna be honest with you. Low key. Yeah. So, Billy, what do you think about the fact that in one hour and six minutes, New Horizons is gonna come out? I don't fucking care. Wow, that's kind of insulting to all the Animal Crossing fans, but okay. It's whatever, I guess. It's really not a big. Oh, yo, I could put, um, I can put a, oh like, the Noid or the, or, or Pop on my umbrella. Oh, yeah, you should do that. <laughs> Which one? Who's on your hat? It's it's the Noid. Oh, uh, then put Pop on your umbrella. Okay. <laughs> uh, I right, put Pop on the umbrella. Did oh you my guys God! See the picture of Smokey the Bear doing coke. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yo, this think? looks crazy. Uh, it was pretty good, yeah, like, low-key, uh, I vibe with it pretty hard, not gonna lie. Wait, you should, you should re redo the Smokey the Bear doing the code in Animal Crossing. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that'd be awesome. That'd be so hard. <laughs> so hard. So hard. Alright, I could do it, though. You just put, just put the picture in the Discord, then. It's gone. It's gonna be a big image because he's sitting on the table. <laughs> he's sitting. He's doing coke can, off of the table. You can like crop it so it's just like the, from the table up, maybe. <laughs> yeah, true, true. I don't know. Why are you so tired? Uh, I don't know, cause, cause like, you didn't let me sleep last night. What were you guys doing last night? Ooh, I cannot talk about that right now. I went to sleep before you. I left and Ashley was still in the chat, but she was asleep. Oh yeah. <laughs> Harold and Dolphin were still talking. That's true. Harold and Dolphin. Yeah, we got so much free money. I don't know what to do with all this free money. I wish you could just get free money in life. Right, Billy? Don't you wish you could just get free money in life? You don't want free money in life? What's wrong with you? Yo, you know it'd be awesome right now? If you mm. like go outside and there's like a hundred dollar bill like on your front step. Oh, okay. Now that's totally epic. Now that's what I call epic.com. It reminds me of like, cool like Oliver. Like, he said that whenever they get together with people. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Um, my uncle from Guatemala, <laughs> like, like, he says that, like, whenever, like, he gets with his friends, um, there's always that one friend that, like, always talks about, like, what would you do if you found a suitcase with a thousand dollars? Oh, that's funny. Like, he says he, like, always brings it up all the time. Yeah. <sighs> um. Yo. Oh, Harold, stop yawning. Why? Why'd you go to sleep? I don't remember, honestly. It was a while. <laughs> um. Regal armor. I got an armoire. Hey, Harold, you know what would be really good that Ashley would really like? What? If you, if you made it, it would be really easy too. It's the Vic mascot. Oh, wait. What's the Vic mascot? Oh, yeah, yo. Oh, so, yeah, does yo. Does the Vic mascot look like Billy? It does. It looks a lot like Billy. Kind of crazy. Hey, heck, yo. The, the Vic mascot is like... Like really good looking. <laughs> Whoa! I'm Yo, not gonna lie. when Billy brought it up, I couldn't believe how incredible he looks. Oh. Holy! Yo, you could buy the freaking big mascot costume. I know. <laughs> it's two hundred and ninety nine euros. <laughs> I know. Yeah. No. It, yeah. It's two hundred and seventy nine. Yo, we should make like the big mascot. Like, we should make like a bootleg 
big mascot and like do it as a mascot for Fastlane. <laughs> Whoa. And I'm gonna put the big mascot in my zine and he's gonna be shooting up heroin. <laughs> oh snap. Yeah, I dropped the pool. The big mascot is gonna be uh, doing heroin in my zine. It's gonna be really cool. Yo, Chris, I don't know if you're still watching or not, but if you can, uh, rate my house. <laughs> Let me know what you think. Is it dope? Is it ugly? You Does should put the pool in the middle of your room. <laughs> in the middle? What about the, 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 the watermelon table? Nah, put that to the side. Alright, fine. I guess you kind of got a point. First, let me take a selfie. Do, 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 do. Um. Okay, I'm gonna put that there. Item. Damn, I got a lot of this. I'm gonna add another item. Hey, what's up, Mabel? Uh, not Mabel, Elaine. I was gonna say Mabel. Oh, now she's gone. <laughs> she, left. she heard me. She's like, oh, actually, I was not trying to go here. Like, sorry. She showed up for like two seconds. Um. Oh, hey, Elaine. She's back. <laughs> Wait. Hello? I just found a, uh, an image. Hello? Oh my god, it's working! Yes. Hey, what's Hi. up? Hi. Hey. Hey. We're talking about what? mascots right now. Hey, what's up? Hi. Welcome to the Shoji Plays Animal Crossing livestream. <gasps> Was that baby? Yeah, hold on. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Damn, that's crazy. That's little baby. Is she going crazy? What's she doing? Have an armchair. What's baby doing? Hello? Uh. <gasps> oh, oh man, I gotta stop yawning. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Does it make you yawn? It makes me feel so sleepy yo uh, um, yeah animal crossing new horizon is coming out in 57 minutes <laughs> no chris don't do that chris said i'm i'm subscribed because you keep yawning and now i'm sleepy i was 11 12 what <laughs> Wait, what what's that mean 11, 12. Deep house. Deep house. Yeah, is Elaine, like, doing something? I don't... Damn, I got the pool in the, in the center. It's lit. Oh, wait, hold on. Two... 
Oh wow. And my house is looking pretty good so far. I gotta say. Looks crazy. I got pop on, on the wall and the noid on the floor. Yeah, you should explain what all that is. Um nah, I think I think people like like the the mystery. <laughs> Alright, that's what's up. Okay, let's see what's left for me to do now. Um, I'm still carrying around this armchair. Eleven slash twelve. Yo, Chris, what's that mean? You wrote house eleven slash twelve. I don't really know what that means. Yo, Billy. Are you going back to Monty? Mole? Well, I... I got an uh, email that said... Uh, basically, like... Everyone who isn't required to live on campus, like... Like, anyone who... Doesn't mm -hmm. have, like, a permanent housing situation. Mm -hmm is required to move out so oh I, so like you dang so I, i'm going i have to go up tomorrow morning and move my stuff out oh could you uh, see if my if my deodorant is still in in the closet <laughs> yeah i'm pretty sure it's still there <laughs> yeah yeah no it wasn't in, in the like where all the shoes were uh why why'd you put your deodorant in there? I don't remember it. <laughs> it's like on the top shelf, like Okay. You yeah, know. I'll look for it. Yeah. <laughs> um I think Ashley went to some people. Ashlota! Okay, Is Elaine even still in here? I'm here, I'm here. Sorry, oh hey, what's up? Yo, what's baby doing? Uh she's just chilling. <laughs> was she going crazy? Uh, she was mm. fine actually. Um, was she, she meowing? Went a little. When you went outside a little? Yeah, like with her. Like I took her oh my outside. god, really? Oh. Yeah. Just carefully, I guess. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Poor baby. She was so cute. Also, I'm gonna start playing New Horizons. <gasps> When? At, at midnight. Oh, I don't even have the game. I'm gonna yeah, go. Yeah, it's because I got that direct. Download. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I'm gonna go buy it <laughs> tomorrow. Wait, Harold, why don't you just get the digital version? No, because I want a physical copy. Uh, I don't want to just have a digital version of it. You know? If it's a game that I really like, I, I need to have like a physical copy. So. It just it feels weird if it's just a digital download. Yeah, I understand. Yeah. Yo, Elaine, I wish you had like a capture card. Yeah, me too. But it's I don't know. I found if, a cheap if, one. If I were more into doing it than uh -huh. maybe. I found a cheap one that I'm gonna buy and me and Billy are, are gonna split it. But then like um we could probably like if we play the game together somehow we could probably just live stream it oh okay okay yeah that's fire i would watch that yeah that's what's up um let's see i could like visit your town and put it on stream <laughs> yes you could oh my god yeah do that yeah that'd that's be fire. crazy pretty is on my lap right now <sighs> It's so funny how like she would just like come and lay down on my like lap and just pass legs, out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's so funny. Dumb cat. No, don't say that. You're dumb. No, she's not dumb. Yeah, let's oh, yeah, see. I'm not gonna lie, she was pretty dumb. I see. <laughs> Stephanie knows. <laughs> Damn. 
Alright, whatever. Dumb bitches be dumb bitches. <laughs> dumb bitches be like. <laughs> Sorry, Steffi, you were collateral in that statement. I know she's dumb too. <laughs> I mean, you know what they say, it takes one to know one. It does take one to know one. <laughs> Is Lil Kitty dumb? Mm, she's just too thick. <laughs> she's dummy thick. Yeah, she is dummy thick. True. Yo, Elaine, the game is coming out in 51 minutes. 52, 52 minutes. Oh, yeah, 50. Yeah. Yeah. Or, yeah, yeah. Or f 51 minutes and 20 seconds. Okay, I don't have that. So. I have a timer, like, on, on my live stream. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, it's pretty lit. Uh, beep, 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 beep. Yo, Chris, um, you should come to like our next fast life show that that we do. I don't know when the next one is gonna be though, since I don't even. Like, I have no idea if we postponed um, the purgatory one or not. I don't know if it's still gonna be this, like, the same event or something like that. I have no idea. Whoa, there's so much money in the trees today. It's crazy. Dang, I got. A hundred bells for free just now. That's crazy. Yo. So I've been trying really hard not to watch any videos that could potentially spoil like what the new game is gonna be about. Cause like I Samurai. wanted to, huh? Yeah. Um, yeah. I wanted to be like a surprise. So I'm just like not watching any vid, like like any videos about it at all. Because I'm like, I don't care. Like, I want to find out on my own, you know? Yeah. Like, because there's so many videos of people, like, who played it. They're like, oh, uh, I'm going to tell you guys what the new game is going to be like. Oh, no, I haven't watched those videos. I've yeah, and I'm just like, no, 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 I, I don't want to watch that. Like, <laughs> I, I well, wanna... I'll <laughs> play it in 50 minutes and I'll spoil it. For oh, my everyone, God. So. I, I want to go into it blindly and just, like... I don't know. I mean, you can play it, um, but I won't be watching it. So, yeah, like. Oh yeah, I'll just. You can talk about it too. Yeah, it's fine. As long as I don't see it. Yeah. Then I'm happy. Ah, here we go. I feel like it's gonna be so weird how I've been playing this game for like every day. And then I'm gonna then go, yeah, into like yeah. this ultra HD, like New Horizons Animal Crossing. It's gonna be a good, oh. interesting upgrade. By the way, what's the name of that game that you, that you were playing that you said? Was good. Yeah. Uh, sorry, I'm just trying to move a lot of stuff. Um, it's called Astral Chain. Astral Chain. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I, I was it's trying to like, like you... Oh yeah, you go first. Oh no, I I was just trying to like remember what the name was, but Yeah, it's it's kinda like you like are in um there is yeah, I it's a hard concept to explain, but it's almost like Pokemon where you're like catching these beasts or like you're trying to kill these beasts by using um ones that you've like tamed kind of. Mm. And Throughout the game, you collect more and more of them, and then you can use them. Well, sounds like Digimon. Skills. Um, it's you control <laughs> one controller is you control yourself, and the other controller is the creature. Whoa, is, what? Yeah. Oh, so you're controlling yeah. both? What the heck? Yeah. So, and there's like you have a leash, so like <laughs> you use the the chain between you guys to fight, kind of. What? The hell? It's actually really interesting. Wait, is yeah. that a two-player game? Or no? no, no, you you control both. Whoa! But can you make it a two-player game or no? Yeah, you can make it two-player. Um. Oh. It's really good. 
Chris said that he just resubscribed to me, and he said that my house is in it's an eleven out of twelve. Thank you, Chris. <laughs> oh damn it! I gotta stop. <laughs> Had some reason to come in. Yo, Billy. Yeah. Um. Hi. <laughs> What's up? Do you know when you're gonna move back to Montclair? What? And do you know when you're moving back to Montclair? I'm not. Like never? No, like I'm, like. Classes are online for the rest of the semester. I'm pretty sure. Whoa. Well, like they so wait, are, to move out. <laughs> are are you graduating after this? Mm. Yeah. Damn. So you're just not gonna like dorm there ever again? No, I guess not. Damn, that's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> How does it make you feel? I mean, I really don't have that many feelings about it. It's fine. Does it make you sad? No, not really. I was never like really into the whole living at school thing. Yeah. I see. I wonder if Takashi's gonna like come back at all. Well, he moved out, probably didn't. He? Yeah. He well, he, he went back to um to Washington. Yeah. So I, I'm sure he like didn't leave anything there. If he did, that would really sad. But like. Indeed, if he's if he's gonna graduate too. Or... I don't know, actually. I have no idea. I mean, I think he's. It's not. It's not affecting anyone's ability to graduate. Yeah, I know, but like, I'm just wondering if we're gonna see Takashi again. Yeah. Never. Yeah, he's back in Washington, so I mean, I don't know. I think he's in the same grade as uh, as Amanda. And cement. Well, Amanda's a junior. Oh. Cement's a senior. Oh, damn! I have no idea then, actually. Hmm. Oh well. I guess we'll find out. Oh, I'm gonna. Oh yeah. Okay. Here we go. Yo, Ashlota. <laughs> Um, oh my god. Yeah, <laughs> uh, let me go check up on she always here. like knocks out on the street. <laughs> Yo, Elaine, can you hear me? Mm hmm. I, I got a question. Um, mm -hmm. I'm about to write this letter to the museum. What do you think you should say? Uh, I should say. You should say, can I have some garlic? I bet. <laughs> Ken. Uh, did she knock out? <laughs> Wait, can you guys hear me? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, Ashley's like, no. <laughs> <laughs> Stephanie's on Ashley's mic. <laughs> oh my god. That's so funny. She always just <laughs> passes up. How did she just fall asleep so fast like that? This is know. already like an hour past her bedtime. Oh, I guess that makes sense. Like she falls but wait, Steffi, you should um, you should draw a mustache on Ashley. Yeah. Here we go. And here's my letter. Can I have some garlic? I'm gonna put some exclamation marks. Yeah. So my sister's phone is like still on and everything. <laughs> like literally, like the screen is on and like the whole Discord and everything because she's just not speaking. She literally like passed out. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, like the phone is like right next to her and she doesn't, yeah, like brightness is on and everything. <laughs> she's so funny. You should probably just like click the, the end call button. Or maybe not. Yeah, I could, but... She might just wake up she... out of nowhere and then like come she back. She actually might, yeah. Yeah, that's like, true. Nightmare. She like starts screaming. She's like, ah! <laughs> yeah, Ashley is always getting nightmares too. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, y'all are crazy. Yeah, my sister and I are always getting nightmares. We're like, we see each other like the next morning, and Ashley's like, oh my god. Okay, here's my letter. I had a dream that Billy slapped. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> again. I dreamt again that Billy slapped me. Alright, so here's my letter. It says, can I have some garlic? And then there's a, a bunch of, like, screaming emojis. I think it looks pretty good. I'm gonna keep that one. Uh, I'm gonna put this fossil in it. Nice. I love this game. <laughs> oh, good. Now there's 40 minutes left. 41 minutes left until New Horizons comes out. Mm hmm. That's crazy. This is gonna be I'm like, fucking stoked. This is like New Year's Eve. Yeah, <laughs> basically. Basically, New Year's Eve for the Isabel fans. Beep, boop, boop, beep. Yo, I can't stop thinking about that song, like where she's singing. Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop. <laughs> yeah. Beep, boop, 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 beep, boop. Hey, okay. Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop. Beep, beep, boop, boop, beep. <laughs> Fuck, sing it, bitch. <laughs> It's so good. It's such a good song. It really is like it like slaps so hard. <laughs> Damn. I hope they put that song in in the New Horizons game. I am banking on it. I think they will. I'm gonna like jam out so hard. It's gonna be crazy. <laughs> Did you know what sucks? Like. So Isabel is not in this game. No, yes she is. She's not. What? Yeah. She shows up in um I think in Wild World. Then what the fuck is the point? No. Uh no, I think Isab I if I'm not mistaken, I think Oh, I'm about to look it up, but I thought Isabel didn't show up until New Leaf. Oh maybe it is New Leaf then. Yeah, she's a pretty, like, new character, compared to everyone else. Like, she was not a common character. Yet, she is the most affluent. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Interesting choice of adjective. <laughs> the most affluent. <laughs> she is the most affluent character. <laughs> That's funny. What's affluent mean? Usually wealthy, well off. Oh yeah, yeah. She is the yeah. most affluent. <laughs> That's so true. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn, yo, I can't believe Ashlota really knocked out like that. Mm. Alright, here we go. I got a free item from the Lost and Found. I'm living good. Okay. Right, so it says Isabel first appeared in 2012, New Leaf. 2012 in New Leaf? Oh wow. Go off, yeah. Isabel. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. I mean, this game that I'm playing is from 2001, so it's like pretty old. You know? I was six years old when this game came out. Mm -mm. Can you believe people that born in the year 2000 are 20 right now? That's crazy. Yeah. <gasps> oh man. Wait, Katrina. I'm not sure that's here. Oh, I think Katrina's here or something. Katrina, the fortune teller, will be in Fast Life. <laughs> oh, in Fastville on March 21st. Oh. Nice. Cool, cool, cool. You know who was a really good character in Animal Crossing that I don't really see any people discussing? Who? Is, uh. I think this character came out in New Leaf. Oh no, mm. apparently it came out in City Folk and in New Leaf. The character is called Kave. Kave? Mm. Yes. Mm. Yes. Kave appears whenever, um, the day of Festivale. Oh. 
Uh, there's gonna be a sports. Uh, uh, there's a sports festival tomorrow in in my game. So that's gonna be lit. Kill me. <laughs> well, wait, Harold. Uh, hmm? The game you're playing, it's called City Folk. No, it's just called Animal Crossing. Oh. Yeah, it's like the the original. Hmm. Yeah. Like, there's no cafe in this game either. What about a dance club? No, nothing. But KK Slider shows up, but he shows up next to the train station. Hmm. Yeah. Um. What was I gonna do? I forgot now. Oh, yeah, I need to go mail out the letter. Beep beep boop beep boop beep beep boop boop beep Right here's the post office. You gotta mail out this little this letter to the museum. Send them a fossil. And we should be good to go. I keep thinking about the <clears throat> big mascot. Oh, the big, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Ashley lost her mind when I showed it to her. <laughs> she, had, makes... she had no idea that Big had a mascot. Well, no, she knew about it, but she just like, I just like reminded her. Yeah. Like, he wears you, like you, a. You kind of take the big guy for granted. Yeah, definitely. Yo, so you guys know the dog called a bichon, or like a bichon? A bichon per se? Yeah, like. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That one, that one. <laughs> the bichon per se. Okay. <laughs> what if I draw that on Animal Crossing tonight? I think you should draw the big guy though. No, but no, yeah, but I I, the but there's guy. no pattern for the big guy. Well, that's why you make one. No, that's too hard. The big guy's really easy no, to make. He's literally, super simple. Literally, all you gotta do is draw a black dot, a black circle with like a hmm. white circle over the top to make it, you know, for like uh reflection, you know, where the light hits, and then a, hmm. a yellow blazer and a black tie. <laughs> Okay, okay, I, I can I can kind of see it. He's wearing yellow yeah. shorts, and... No, it's on board. <laughs> yeah, okay. I, I, I kind of like it. I'm into the idea. Not gonna lie. It's not a bad idea. And you know what? I might do that. <clears throat> uh, okay, here, let's see. I'm gonna figure out a way to, like... Create a template. Yo, Billy, what did you do today? Um, pretty much I just played Final Fantasy. Oh yeah, I, I saw that on, on the uh, Switch. Yeah. I was trying to make like some music, but like I couldn't come up with anything good. Oh. Stevie has been working on a song for like the past two days. Yeah, I listened. It sounds pretty cool so far. Yeah, it's crazy. Uh uh, yeah, I've been doing a lot of things to it. <laughs> I kind of gave up on it for a second just because I need to have time to reflect. Yeah, true. Because I, li I was literally like out of flow uh, from. Uh, I've been like, there and I've done that. Until today. And I was like, I need to mm. stop. I need to stop. Okay. I think. Alright, I think I got. I got this, this idea so far for how to draw the big guy. <laughs> Mm. All right, yo, Chris. If you're still watching, I hope you know about the big mascot, like the pens. B I C. As uh, I'm about to go draw him. Oh, oh snap. Mm -hmm. Yo, uh. <laughs> Yo, Billy, I was so close to, like, 
I was about to start playing the, Z the Breath of the Wild game. <laughs> and but like as soon as I was about to start playing it, it was like, oh, you need to download the up uh, the the update first. And I was like, oh, okay, whatever. And then I was downloading the update, and it took so long. And then like, and then as soon as it finished, like downloading, Steffi was gonna leave my house, and I wanted to like play it with like with Steffi basically, but but she left, so I I just didn't play it. <laughs> I'm gonna play it though. Don't worry. I got you in a couple years. You gonna play it like three months. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, probably like three months. Okay. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna look at a reference picture. Uh, and you know what? I could probably upload the picture of the big guy on t onto OBS. Oh yeah, do it. Okay. Yeah, you should have like the the picture that you're trying to draw like next to it. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm gonna do that. Okay, here we go. All right, perfect. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you're watching the stream, but but it's right here. <laughs> yeah, I see it. Okay, I'm gonna just do something. Um, Can do his whole body? Though? Nah, cause cause it's hard to see like if it's his whole body. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna do some crazy ready. Okay, here we go. Oh no. Disappeared. <laughs> Shut up, I'm gonna do something crazy. <laughs> Wait, what? Sorry, I was talking to someone else. That shut up is not for anyone here. <laughs> okay, yeah, I was like, wait, what? Yeah. Are you, you no, just told I'm me talking. to shut up? You talking to me? You telling me to shut up? Who, who you saying shut up to? My sister. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I love my sister. You have a sister? Yes, I do. Okay. She was just on. on stream, actually. Like. Oh, cool. Like she was talking. Well, like on my mic. Ah. Uh, yeah, this is not gonna work. Let's see. What did Ali say to you guys? What did what? Oh, she was talking about my sister. Well, we asked her big chungus. Oh. Wait, hold on. Wait, we you asked her big chungus. <laughs> we asked her if she knew about big chungus. Oh. I actually, was just asking her about mascots. That's all. Okay. I love big chungus. <laughs> yeah, he's the best. Big chungus. <laughs> it's time, big chungus. Hey, have dolphin. You, have you guys ever heard of the uh, Mandela effect with big chungus? <laughs> Whoa. No. Wait, I, I severely doubt that. Hey, what's up, Dolphin? Yeah. You just jumped in on the perfect time. Alright. Yo, yo. Dolphin Screech. <laughs> oh, man. So, like, I, I'm really... I'm really just kidding, but, uh... I did see, like, a third of people who were saying that, like... Big it's Chungus time. actual name Chungus. is Chungos. <laughs> Chungos? Chungos. G-O-S? Yeah. That's not true. That's not true. That's not true. It's very suspicious to me. I know. It's a Mandela effect. Yeah, I don't know about that. I don't know, man. Something about that just... It just rubs me. In the right way. That was a twist. Huh? What a twist. What a twist. <laughs> how, was, how was your day, um... Dolphin? Uh, my day is pretty good. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. I'm pretty good? Yeah, pretty, 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 oh, very pretty, pretty good. Nice. That makes me really, really happy. Oh, good. How was your day? Um, really bad. Nah, I'm just kidding. Ooh. It wasn't that oh, bad. Okay, good. <laughs> uh, but it was a little bad. Nah. 
It was, uh, oh, decent. Oh, good. Yeah. I mean, I didn't do much today, but... Oh, I see. Yeah. Um, let's see. Alright, so I don't know if you've heard anything of, like, what we were talking about, but... Basically, what I'm... That's all I heard. Yeah. So, basically, what's happening is that I'm gonna draw the mascot from Bic. I don't know if The you... lighter guy? Yeah, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, the little... I don't know, like, if you've ever seen the mascot of, of Bic. Yeah, the lighter guy. Y yeah, how would you describe him? He's a, he's a guy made out of a lighter. No. Or a match? Um, nope. Ah. I'm thinking of another... No, it's 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 the same it's the same company. I thought I thought the big guy is supposed to be the uh, like he's supposed to represent like a match. Like he's got like a like a black head or something like that. Yeah, yeah, he's got a black head. But how does that represent? I, as a match, I, I thought it was. I, a, I always thought it was supposed to be like a ball point. Like a ballpoint pen. Yeah, I think it is. It's supposed to be like a ballpoint pen. Oh, ballpoint pen. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I okay. saw it in my head, I just couldn't describe it with my words. <laughs> okay, here we go. Damn. See that? That looks crazy. Okay. I'm actually not good. at my computer, so I can't see nothing right now. Ooh. Your Billy. Uh, do you see this? Yeah. What you think? It looks really good so far. Yeah. It's crazy. Harold was like, oh, this is gonna be so hard. <laughs> Harold can do anything. That's, that's true, yeah. But Billy is the one that doubts me a lot, though. Oh, well. Harold, I was watching uh, BoJack Horseman, uh -huh. and the character Todd strongly reminds me of you. Oh my god, why? <laughs> um, I don't know, you're, like, Todd is always positive and mm -hmm. even, and he has a lot of interesting conversation topics. <laughs> cool. I'll it's take that as like, a compliment. Yeah, I don't know, like, you never seem to indicate that anything is ever, like, wrong in uh -huh. your world. Yeah. Which is kind of like Todd's approach to stuff. Mm. It's just everything just evens out for Todd, you know. Yeah, no, that's that's very true for me. I I would it's say. Uh, I feel like I don't know. I feel same like with it's... Jerry Seinfeld, but you don't complain. Oh, as much. I mean Jerry Seinfeld. I he's he's different, man. I've seen some interviews yeah. of him like really complaining about um like certain shit. <laughs> like, yeah. But like his character, his character in the show. Was uh, there was an episode where he's like, always oh, he evens out for me. Oh yeah, I, in, in the show that's how he is, but in real life he's kind of like an asshole. Real life, yeah, he complains a lot. Yeah, <laughs> I mean the the entire like show was basically based on complaining. Yeah, that's kind of what curb like. Um, yeah. Oh yeah, Larry David. He yeah, yeah. That's kind of what. The show. Yeah, the whole show is just him just complaining about shit. <laughs> like everything's fine, and then he complains, and then it causes problems. Yeah. <laughs> that's so funny. Oh man, good times. But no, you're much more of a Todd than a Jerry Seinfeld. Oh, even you. though things even out for both of them. Yeah, that's true. I I appreciate that. Yeah. Who? Does anybody else watch Project Horseman? No. Not really. No. Me neither. No, I've, I, I saw an episode, I saw like the first episode, like when it first came out, and then I kind of uh -huh. just forgot about it. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I firmly believe that it was one of the weakest openings to oh, like a really? tremendously good, for like a tremendously mm -hmm. good show. I can see like, that. Usually the first three episodes are interesting, and then it just takes like a nosedive. But it was mm -hmm. the opposite. The first three episodes were really bad mm. and boring, and then and then they got weirdly good after that. Damn, <laughs> that's so weird. Setting so expectations so really low. Which like season would you say that that is? It's like the best one, or like the best season? Oh, uh, I don't know. They're all. Mm -mm, they're all what? 
they're all blending together at this point. I'm uh, on season six. I'm on the final season. Hmm, I see. Okay, here we go. Okay, I think this is looking pretty good, actually. Damn, I, I, I thought this was going to be so much harder. And, mm, the dick? Yeah. <laughs> but it's actually not that hard. And we got a decent. Okay. Oh god, Jesus Christ. Yo, lamb lamb meat is one of the grossest meats to cook. <laughs> lamb? I don't like lamb. But are you cooking that? I well, I made it last night. Remember? And oh then I, yeah. I made it again tonight, and I'm like, oh my god, there is so much fat everywhere. <laughs> Whoa. I didn't notice how much fat there was last night. Yeah. I, was, I guess I was too tired when I was washing the dishes. <laughs> mm, I can see that. It's so oily. Ugh. It's it's oily. Uh, yeah, now I want to take a shower again. <laughs> I took three showers today already. Oh no. Wait, you took three showers? No, no, I took two showers. I took a shower last night because I wanted to wash my hair, but last night was really today. Hmm. And then I took a shower when I got home from uh, rollerblading with Ehi. <gasps> Ehi was rollerblading? No, no, he was running and I was rollerblading. Oh, <laughs> nice. I can yeah, see he, that. No, he runs. Like, yeah, he's crazy. In fact, like it was a little wet. The roads were a little wet today. Mm. Oh, really? And oh yeah, yeah. Just from the last night, and um, because of that, I had no traction. Mm -hmm. So like, he really, he really beat me this time. Yeah. I wasn't able to like accelerate quickly at all. Um, Daniel, back at it again. I think, um, this is random, but I think Flamingos is, is in Mexico still. Yeah. I think he's just gonna stay there. Yeah, probably. And for like a while. Yeah. Does he have family in Mexico? Um, I don't think so. Girlfriend. Oh, no, no. He, no. Um, his girlfriend's from oh, Peru, right? Yeah, yeah, oh, his yeah, girlfriend's yeah. from Peru, so. He might be with, um, Macross. Oh, that that's a possibility, yeah. Because Macross is from Mexico, right? And yeah. That's how I actually talked to Aaron. That's how he met his his girlfriend. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I I think he told me that. Yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, look at this. Yo, Billy, do you see this? Yeah, it looks really good. Damn, this actually does look pretty good. And should I make it orange or yellow? That, like that. That's what we're gonna like, like not like this. More, more RNG. Alright, so so RNG is better then. Yeah. I feel like I made him too like thin. No, I think it looks good. Hmm. You gonna do the pen in the background? Yeah. <laughs> okay, good. Um. Dun, dun, dun. Damn, this looks crazy. So I have a question prompt for everybody. Oh hell if, yeah! Uh, if you'll let me, uh, if you'll let me lead that conversation, oh, hell you? yeah! So I got this is what I got. Okay. The world is about to end, like really, like it's gonna end really, really soon. Uh -huh. And somebody hands you the aux cord mm -hmm. for the entire world. What do you pick for everybody to listen to Oof. right before the world ends? I want to hear what Steffi says first. Oh, yeah, that's super hard. I don't... <laughs> Come on, don't be shy. Put some more. Um, don't be shy. Put some more. Don't be shy. Put some more. For the entire world to hear. The entire the world, world to hear. Yeah. Everybody. Damn, that's crazy. Damn. Yeah, you got a lot of power. Wow, that's epic. Okay. Um, <laughs> totally epic. Okay, now uh, this is epic. Man, 
and I have no idea. Alright, could I okay, can we could I ask uh uh, uh Okay, what's see? a lane pick? Yeah. Hmm. Alright, so the question is, um yo Dolphin, could you say the question again? <laughs> yes. Okay. The world is a the world is about to end. And somebody hands you the aux cord. What is the last thing that you play that everybody on the earth hears? Oh my god, what a good question. <laughs> okay, um, are you looking for like a serious answer or like I do not care. At okay. All. Mm. <clears throat> okay, I have to think about this. Yeah, okay. think about it. Does it have to be a song that you guys know? No. I don't I just care. Something, and then Harold, can you play it out loud and see if you sure. guys agree? <laughs> okay. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Oh my god, yeah, it would have to be... Oh, sorry, sorry, you go. Oh, no, 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 it's okay, no, continue your talking. No, 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 I, I don't even know what I was about to say, so you... Oh, you... okay. <laughs> you go. No, I was gonna say, like, imagine how, like, how weird or kind of funny, I guess. I don't know, maybe it's just, like, my humor. If, like, just, like, making or forcing the whole world to listen to Satisfaction by Benny Benny. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, that's, like, a Push funny me answer. Push and then just touch me <laughs> till I can get my That is faction. That is faction. That is... <laughs> That is. I just oh. imagine like the whole entire world. Oh, okay. Oh, ah. like, uh, everybody of like every age. Yo, you know? Billy, do you see this? Yeah, it looks really good. Damn. Wait, you should make the, the like the little clip on the pen a little bit shorter. A little bit shorter. Yeah. Right. Tiny okay, I feel you. Okay, how is Oh my god, I can't think that? of anything. Does that look good, Billy? Yeah, that looks better. Because before it looked kinda of looked like a sword. It looked like a bus. Oh sword. yeah. Or maybe just like a little bit like because that. Damn, this is looking pretty good so far. Damn, I'm shocked by how good this looks. <laughs> Would it be bad if I just said my mix? <laughs> <laughs> my no. mix. Ah. No, 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 that's not my final answer. <laughs> But wouldn't that be funny? Like, I'm That would be dope. I mean, I don't know. I think that's a good uh, choice. Mm. If I'm being honest. No, honestly, I, I don't know if this would be my final answer, but I, I kind of think that, like, the emotional impact of, like, playing... Sandstorm by the root would be pretty good. Oh. Yeah. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. That would be crazy. Oh man. Oh my god. I together a live band when I was studying in England and we played uh for our one of our last gigs, we played like a trance medley uh -huh. where we played that was the what we closed on. We closed the show on uh uh the root sandstorm. Down buddy buddy boom. Yeah, it's probably the thickest show. Buddy, 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 buddy. Damn, that's such a mmm. That's a that's a hard question. Yo, Billy. Mm -hmm. Um, what? What? I fucking miss you, bro. <laughs> yeah, he really misses you. Damn. Yeah, but Billy doesn't care. Oh, the only thing Billy cares about is play switch and lie. <laughs> lie. Play switch and lie. Damn, yeah, this big mascot looks great. I'm so proud of this. Damn. Do you see this, Steffi? Oh, hold on. My, my screen, like, fell right. off. That's what's up. Yeah, it looks really good. 
It's crazy. Damn, look at that. Now that's what I call art. 2015. Like you can see him holding the pen and like behind his back, like crazy. Okay, I've decided. Okay. What? It would probably be um like the Miku song by Anamakuchi. <laughs> oh, Miku, Miku, you can Miku, call me Miku. Miku. Yeah. That would be so I'm, I'm thinking good. Miku, Miku. Ooh. Is that is that it? I'm thinking yeah. Miku, Miku. Awesome. Yeah, that, I, I gotta say mm -hmm. that that is a quality a quality song yeah. and it's a quality song, song to end the world. But I would be dancing. 100%. I know, me too. Miku, ooh, ooh. I actually have a handful of uh, remixes of that song that I want to post in the uh, in the music thread because I had to DJ um, an anime convention recently. Mm -hmm. No and I just way. Kept on kept on finding so I'm gonna Ooh, just... do you know what oh man all right wait wait first i want to hear what billy picks yeah yeah i want to hear that too. I, I have no idea come on billy he what would you pick to troll everybody oh shit um oh wait i can i can think of something good for this okay just... y'all want to hear mine <laughs> Yes. All right. Yeah, I'm absolutely. gonna I'm gonna put it on the on the YouTube stream. Um. No, actually, no, no. Fuck that. Cause then it's gonna get demonetized. I'm gonna put it on the yeah, Discord. Okay. okay. Um. So, cause I want to simultaneously like confuse people, but also make them cry. Like <laughs> I want to make them feel something, but they don't know like why why they're feeling it. And you know. So okay. Uh. Hold on, that copy link. Okay. Um. Yeah. Was it Mac DeMarco? Nah. <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah. No. Um. Here we go. I think this. Uh, yeah, I just put it on the Discord. It's uh, it's a song by James Blake. Oh. <laughs> by what? By James Blake. Oh, by James Blake. Yeah. Is it on the general chat? Yeah, it's on the general mm -hmm. chat. Um, good. Yeah, I love him, but this is actually one of my all-time favorite songs by James Blake. But I feel like if I played it like at the end of the world, people would just have this like really confusing, empty feeling, and they just wouldn't know what to do. And like, uh, uh, so, so how so. come you want to give that feeling onto people? I, I don't know. I want them to just like question everything like not just like their life or like why the world is ending but just like literally everything and like i feel like this 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 uh song will force them to do that i would pick uh big city dreams but i never shot never <laughs> whoa that's so good oh my god you know, we're both little people and you like it that way, but times I want to put this body shame, grow old, wear a suit like my old man, pack up all my things and get my ass out of town. We gotta go, whether you like this town or not. Anyway. <laughs> That's a really good choice, Billy. I, I kind of wish I picked that, that instead. Fuck. I know. Um, you know what? Hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna rethink m my answer. Oh, Alright, well, I oh. dropped two. One is by um my boy Ben Aqua, and the other one is by my other boy Lazy Disc. Okay, I'm listening. Wait, it's on the Discord. Both are really really good. Yeah. Oh, you put it on the on the, on on the, the music thread. Oh, yeah. of the of the Miku song. Yeah, yeah. I'd want if if we were going with Miku um, as the last song, I would wa I specifically want to hear a medley of the original and these two remixes because they're all really good. Whoa! But that's not my answer. Okay. <laughs> Yo, New Horizons comes out in seven minutes. Nice. That's crazy. It is. That's kind of low key wild. Yo, yeah, Billy, can you see my stream? <laughs> Yeah. Dude, look at this. Oh, it's on your hat? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this 
This looks crazy. Oh, this is one of my best drawings so far. Oh, I'm so glad I got that. Yeah, that's that's really good. That looks good. Yo, Steffi. Yeah. And do you think I should draw a Bichon fries? <laughs> fries. <laughs> fries. <laughs> a Bichon frise or something. The remixes are sick. Thank you. What? Why did you say thank you? <laughs> Joji. No, no, that was yeah, Billy. That, that wasn't. That was Billy that said that. It wasn't even no, me. No, I heard that oh. voice. That was definitely Harold. Damn, y'all are just roasting me out here. Like Harold's catchphrase is saying, like, "Thank you." Yeah, I know. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> congratulations. Congratulations. Oh, yo, did you congratulate BB yet? Um, I'm gonna make sure to do that. On my leg. Okay, so pick her up and just be like, congratulations. Yeah, good job, <laughs> baby. You gotta congratulate them. Harold, did you come up with your uh, alternative answer? Oh, not yet. I, I got distracted. <laughs> um, did everybody else give their input? Uh, well, not Ashley, because she's knocked oh. out. Um, oh. Wait, did you pick yours? I I have mine. I had thought of it since I thought of the question. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, Steffi though. I still need Steffi to answer my question. Which is? Um, should I draw a Bichon Frise? Uh yes. <laughs> Here. Wait, hold on. What should we like, what should I be doing in the game when when the five minutes are up and and New Horizons is out? Um, I don't know. What what do you want to do? Uh, hmm. If if it were my stream, I would play. Uh, I would play. Um, for like one day and then go back. Wait, what? I'd play New Horizons for like one, just go back to the GameCube version. Oh, but I don't have it. What? I don't have um, New Horizons. Right. Yeah, well, I mean, it would, would definitely be contingent on you having it for sure. So wait, you said that you would play it for a day? If it, I'm just saying, if it was if it was my stream, mm -hmm. like if I if I was in your shoes and I was gay, mm -hmm. I would I would play New Horizons for like one day just to celebrate and then thank you. Oh yeah, yeah. True. I feel you. But, but you need to do whatever you I mean, think is gonna be. I mean, I would do that, but I can't do that. So, I mean, because you don't. Yeah. Have it. Yeah, I don't have the game, so I'm kind of screwed. Yeah. Do you uh, do you not have the the money budgeted to uh, download it? Oh no, I'm gonna buy it uh, at, at uh, like at Walmart. Oh, <clears throat> uh, oh, you're waiting to get the physical copy? Yeah, yeah. Oh, but you're exactly. corn. Yeah. Well, I mean, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to Walmart. I don't care about that. <laughs> I'll just well, I'll just wear a mask and some gloves or something. Uh, that's true. You're yeah. gonna have to. I mean, if you really don't want to catch it, you're gonna have to wear more than that. But oh, I mean, I do have like a little suit. But I mean, I doubt there's gonna be that many people at Walmart either. Yeah, just to, you know, you got that six feet. Yeah, I see. I'll 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 grab it and then um I'll take it to the self checkout and then I'll run home. It should be okay. Oh man, the All game. Right, so <laughs> the game comes out in three minutes. I know. Oh shit! Oh I fuck! I don't know what to do. Um. Uh, yeah, what could you do? Damn. I don't know. I'll go draw the Bichon. <laughs> well, we can. Yeah. Oh yeah, do that. That's kind of what you've been up to this whole time. So, <laughs> as well, stay consistent. Well, I mean, I, I finished drawing 
the big uh, character. Yeah. Wait, so Slippy, what's a better dog to draw? Oh, wait. What's the name of that one dog that you love? It's called like an uh, African This picture. Uh. Wait, how, how do you spell the first word? I believe it's spelled A F F I I. Wait, I'm sorry. Wait, A F F S. I believe that's what it's called. Oh, F and F and Pincher. Oh yeah. Oh my God, that dog looks crazy. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm gonna see if I can f figure out like a way to draw it. Oh nah. Okay, what's another dog I could draw? Mm. Mm. Wait, why oh does it have to be a dog? Well, it doesn't have to be a dog. Oh my god, the game's gonna come out in one minute exactly. Oh my oh, god. Mm, damn, that's crazy. Whoa, what the hell? <laughs> Let's do a countdown. Um, freestyle. Or something. Your dolphin, are you at, at, at your keyboard? I am. You should play something um, in the last few seconds before the countdown. Oh, let me pull up like a like a synth horn sound. Ooh, we got twenty seconds. Synth bass. Ooh, shit. Okay. Ooh. Okay. There are twenty seconds. Now, yeah, yeah, 20 seconds left. 20 seconds now? Yeah. Oh, snap. Uh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> okay, here All we right, go. Alright, I'm, I'm ready. Six, five, four, three, two, one. New Horizons is out! <laughs> yeah! Congratulations, Elaine. Are you, you're now the proud <laughs> owner of New Horizons. Congratulations to Baby. Congratulations to Baby. I'm gonna boot it up right now. Damn. That's crazy. I'm kinda jealous. It's okay. It will be you one day. Yeah. Well, it'll be me in a few hours. <laughs> oh, are you going to bed? Well, yeah, I guess technically today, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um. I'll, I'll go to Walmart. <laughs> You should play the sure. audio, huh? I was gonna say, uh, did you, uh, think of the song yet? Oh, fuck, I forgot. Please don't hate, hate me. Please I don't, don't hate you. No, please don't hate me. I'm trying okay, so hard. Okay, I won't. Okay, thank you. I really appreciate that. Actually. Okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. Damn, New Horizons is out now. That's... That's crazy. <laughs> it's saying that I can't play. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's so oh no, you you bought a bootleg version. Elaine, no. throw it on the ground. Hurry, drop it. Drop it on the ground right now. Be careful. That is not that's not an that's not a real copy, Elaine. You got to drop it on the ground. Oh, I got Fuck, damn, you got scammed, Elaine. No, it's okay. I'll wait until it's fine. That's what happens when you buy a... Uh, when you don't get a physical copy. Okay, here we go. Two, eight. Eight. Damn, I still can't believe that Ashley just like knocked out <laughs> on midstream. Um, 
Am I really? Who, gonna... I think I think she stayed on the stream when like I was uh, making dinner last night and everybody else left. Oh. I just kept on hearing like shuffling in the background. Oh my god. <laughs> That's funny. But she was just like passed out on like on the fucking. Uh... On the chat, yeah. The <laughs> chat. That's so funny. Oh, here we go. Okay, um, man, I'm, tr I'm really trying to think of, like, a good song to play for the end of the world. Okay. Mm. Mine would be, mine would be a, a, med a medley. It's oh, the end owned. of the world medley. Huh. First, first, you mm -hmm. would hear Caramel Dance and Nightcore. Oh my god. Then you would hear <laughs> then you would hear the intro to Welcome to the Black Parade. Oh my god. To join because, um, the Black Parade. Real real emo boy. And then he said finally when. you'd end on Hallelujah Chorus into Macintosh Watch. Damn, so you you made like you got a whole mix for the end of the world. Oh yeah. Yeah. Damn. I'm a DJ. Oh yeah. Hello, DJ. I'm, I'm, if somebody hands me the aux cord, like, I'm not just gonna be like, oh, I'm just gonna plug in Spotify and play something on my phone. I'm, no, I'm gonna <laughs> have, like, the decks ready. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Well, let's see, but that's a different question, then. That's, like... Well, I already have it mixed, so, like, I just need to... I can just do it on my phone, but, uh... <laughs> oh, okay, know, so preferably, you, if my decks are nearby, I'll plug in my deck. Huh? Mm. You'll have it pre-mixed. Yeah, yeah. I'll have it pre-mixed, and I'll have it uploaded to SoundCloud. <laughs> the end of the world mix. Caramel Dance and Welcome to Black Parade, Hallelujah Chorus, Mac Dash Boy. Hallelujah. I would play... Yo, Steffi. But you're still here? Yeah, I'm still here. Okay, I would play that, that song, um, Mumbo Numbo 5. <laughs> like imagine hearing like those horns. It's like boom, 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 I feel like that would make a lot of people like kill themselves. <laughs> like I got I can't do this. They're like I'm gonna end it all right now. Is that a B28? Yeah, that's crazy. Yo, Steffi, what other songs would you pick? Um. Yeah, I mean, like, I think the, the Rude Sandstorm is a solid, like, pick. Mm. I would not be um, upset if that was the last song yeah, that true. I heard before the end of the world. I mean, it's like, it's one of those songs that, like, everybody knows. Yeah, that's true. And, like, and it's, like, so... Oh, you know what other song? Oh, I know, I know the what song, other song. The, like, Sandstorm sounds like a roller coaster. It does. Yeah. That's why they play it at Six Flags all the time. It feels like a roller coaster. Yeah. Mm. Your dolphin... What song mm. were you gonna pick a hero? Oh. Okay, the the other song I would pick, just because it's, I think it's one of the best songs ever, is um mm -hmm. I got I I gotta get through this by Daniel Daniel uh, Bedingfield. Yeah. Boom, 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 boom. That would actually be a really good song. Boom, boom. I gotta get through this. Gotta get through this. Mm. I gotta make. Mm. Uh, um. I would also love to hear um a thousand miles. My favorite. Oh pop my song. god. I feel like another song that I would pick. Oh my god. Oh my god, that would be so good. <laughs> bitty, bitty, bitty. And okay, I would. Oh, it is? Whoa. Damn. Whoa. Jesus, that sounds crazy. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. I'll play it on any, uh, any FM synthesizer instrument that you want. Um, a Rhodes. Oh, perfect. B P N O one. Here we go. Oh shit! Here. Whoa. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. I know that's that's a good. I like E P N O two better on this synth. Damn. You want to hear it on um, folk guitar? 
Sure. Whoa. Actually, that's too low. That's better. What is that? Is is that like a folk guitar? No, I mean like what are you actually playing it on? Uh Yamaha YS100. Whoa. It's a four operator FM synthesizer, very similar to operator in Ableton. Oh, um, nice. And it's not just limited to uh, uh, sine waveforms. You can, I think Whoa, you got sine, crazy. saw, triangle, where, 50% square. How about Angel Choir? This is a very Porter Rock sound. Oh my god. Oh wow, that sounds crazy. That that does sound just like Porter Robinson. What else do I got? Dun, dun. Oh, this is like an Animal Crossing organ. Whoa. Very sound font. <laughs> Funky clap. Harpsichord sounds cool. I got to use that in the song. Oh, vibraphone's my favorite. Ooh. <laughs> That also sounds like Porter Robinson. This is, um, actually, I used to know this song. Um, la 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 da, da. Oh, Yes! It goes around and round and round and la la. Goes around and round and. It was so good. Yes. Yeah, so it. much epic. So much win. What else I got? Ooh, music box. I could play, um... Such an epic win. Ah, I forget how to play a great fairy song. Such an epic win. <laughs> I'm gonna learn how to play the Great Prairie song right now. The what song? The Great Prairie song, because I pulled up the uh, music. The oh, that's Prairie actually song. harp. I need to get the harp back. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Harold, you would know about the Great Prairie song if you played the game. I don't play you. Oh. Alright, fine. I'll play it tonight. Alright, here we go. Let me play it. Yo, yo, Billy. Mm, um, doesn't his uh his his piano have so much wind? I was thinking that that piano has won the internet for today. Yeah, that piano has won the internet today. With my Yamaha? Yeah, you just won the internet, bro. Think about that. <clears throat> that was legitness. Easier than learning how to play it. Huh? Mm, I don't know, dude. I uh, think fine. you just won the internet. I just want to like, keep on. It sounds like I'm like, I said. I can't wait to play New Horizons. Dude. Is it still downloading? Um. It's loaded. I'm on the. Screen. Oh wow. You should play well, the audio on it. the Discord. Should I what? You should play the audio. Oh you want me to play the how do I play the audio? Um just hold it up to your mic. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait, hold on. Do 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 Yo, next time that Ashley, like, comes on the stream, she's gonna see the big... <laughs> big yeah. guy. She's gonna be like, whoa! Oh, Yo, Steffi. Yes. So, what do you think I should draw next? Like, do you think I should draw, like, a specific breed so of dogs? you draw anything, right? Yeah. Alright, um... Hmm. 
I want to draw something that looks real, like like a dog, like a specific breed or something, or or like something like that, or like a. Why a dog? Or I don't know, just something that's specific enough, like a celebrity or something like that. Who? <laughs> <laughs> oh? I was gonna say Larry the cucumber at first. <laughs> Probably could. Uh, oh, you should draw Vanessa and a Hudgens. Oh my God. Yeah, I was going to say that uh, one of my my other end of the world song would be Sneaker Night. Sneaker Night. <laughs> yes. Wait, Sneaker Night. Yeah, my yeah, Vanessa Hudgens. Wait, who's yeah. that boy? I just love that song. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Wait, isn't it? Yeah, that's right. It's sneaking tonight. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's, Yo. She, she goes, like, like, one of the lyrics is like, basically what we're gonna do is dance. <laughs> Wait, do you know what other song would be really good? Uh, well, what? Uh, another song I would pick would be um that song that goes like, shoes. Let's get some shoes. Let's party. These shoes rule. These shoes suck. These shoes suck. Wait, do you want to hear the sound? Can you hear the sound? Yeah, um, yeah, put it up to the mic. <gasps> Is that Isabel? No, it's Tommy and Timmy. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna kill them. Oh my goodness, they sound so cute. They're adorable. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Wow. You just spoiled it for me now. Oh well. All around the world. It goes around and around and down and down and down. Mm -mm -mm. Wait, so Steffi. It's a, who should I draw? Oh, you said, you said, um, Vanessa Hudges. Okay. Yeah. Vanessa Hudges. Okay. I'm going to see if I can find a pattern. Um, Oh yes, okay. Oh there, snap. There is one on that website. Yeah, there's like a lot. <laughs> there's like a lot. Holy crap. Oh my god, this is so funny. Oh, this is hilarious. Oh yeah, I'm I'm drawing this. <laughs> Wait, you should send it in uh, the chat. <laughs> uh, it's gonna look really tiny. But or put it put it on the uh the on your screen. <laughs> I'll put it on my screen. Okay. Alright, hold on. Alright. I'm gonna put it on the Discord too. <laughs> No, wait, no, I kind of want it to, like, I want it to be, like, a surprise. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, cool. I got it. I'm gonna... Dude. Okay, this, this one might take a little bit longer, but I'm gonna try to be as quick as possible. Here we go. Put it up to the mic. 
No, 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 there's not making any sound. It's just you can customize your mouth, the mouth of your character. You can customize like... your mouth? Whoa. Is that a spoiler? Did you just spoil something? Maybe. I don't know, it's fine. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. Damn, I can't believe I'm gonna make a Vanessa just. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can't wait. I'll be lit. Na 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 It goes around and around and around and around. Yo, Billy, what are you doing right now? I'm playing Final Fantasy. Oh, nice. We're all gaming out here. Just gaming. Just a gamer doing gamer things. Nothing different. No big deal. Nothing new. Here's my, my Vanessa Hudges. Let's play. Hudgens, whatever. Okay. I'm gonna start with 12. playing <laughs> kind of just like zoned out okay let's see So how's the game in lane so far? It's good. Anything crazy? Um, um my flight is landing on the island, which is really cute. <laughs> okay, here we go. Doo -doo -doo. That that you're playing, great fairy song. What song? Great fairy song. 
Mm, I have no Have idea what's on this. Have you ever played a Zelda game? Nope. Oh, no. Sorry. You've never played any Zelda game? I'm not a dweeb, Billy. Something you should know about me? I'm not really what you would call a dweeb. Just asking. So you think I'm a dweeb? Damn it, I keep... missing it. Um, damn, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go up to 16. Okay, cool. Hmm. Okay. Bim, bim. Do you know the song, Billy? Yeah, of course. Nice. I'm proud of you. I'm gonna play the game with my headphones, so I'll see you okay. guys later. Okay. That's fine. Uh, Have fun. <laughs> I definitely drove her away with my heart. <laughs> no, no, it wasn't that. It was because I've I've been meaning I've been thinking about this game since November. True. I want to give it attention. <laughs> You're right. Yeah, All right, fair, I'm fair. gonna do that. Yo, um, Elaine, you should send me your switch code later or something. Yes, yes, I will definitely. That do way that. we can figure out how it works. But yeah. All right, cool. peace out. Okay, baby. Okay. Which two of lesser berries have sent down while I huh? practiced over this? Nothing. Wait, what? Nothing, no. Uh, you're making fun of me? No, no. Okay, good. <laughs> go three 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 go into three four two, three four here we go man this is gonna take a while <laughs> oh this is hard does it look like Vanessa Hudgens yet? It looks just like her. Nice. Thank you. Three, four. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Three, four, six, seven. And do you know what? I think I'm gonna do this later because this is just gonna take way too long. No, do it. Right now? Alright. Yes. Okay, okay, fine. I'll do it now. <laughs> This is gonna take so long! Is that the new Porter Robinson song? Uh, this is a new new job base. Oh. So tell me how the hell the walk on water. <laughs> he, he what? really dumbed down his he really dumbed down his songwriting for uh, this record. Cause, oh yeah. Because he was having like a really hard time putting out new. Have a little existential crisis over writing new material. Really? Yeah. 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 It's. I mean, you can read the lyrics and get it. Uh huh. Because it. It went where somebody. Wait. Like, hold on. Can you repeat man, that? Because it like fucking... your voice is cutting in and out a lot. Oh. Yeah, it's fine. 
uh, uh, I mean, about it on his website. He like he's exposing. Wait, I like can't hear how, you that well. <laughs> it's like oh. really cutting in and out a check, lot. Check, check. One, two, one, two. two. Uh, can you hear me? No? Mm, it's really choppy. Yeah, it's like super choppy. Dropping in and out. Christ almost. Uh-oh. Where's... Oh. Yeah. Reduce some of the rain that's happening on this. Oh, okay. I've got a lot of tabs open. Oh yeah, that's probably it. Did it go? Away? Um, try saying something again. It's better. Uh, Sally said. Oh no, it's still it's still Detroit. super choppy. I think it got worse actually. Ah. Uh, Two three. Uh, uh, let's see. <sighs> testing, testing. Oh yeah, okay. It's it sounds a lot better now. Sally sells, she sells by the seashore. Oh yeah, so much better, way better. Okay, I, I just had to reset my audio driver. Oh, okay, um, nice. Tell me. Oh, but anyway, um, mm -hmm. is it is it still bad? Um, I think it's good now. <laughs> yeah, try. Okay, okay. Um, so, uh, yeah, Porter Robinson released two singles for his new album, mm -hmm. and you can go and, and check them out. They're pretty nice. Yeah. But no, I've, I've, I've heard him like hundreds of times. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, but I think that the, the, the lyrics are a little, uh, a little low effort. It's Wait. probably, for, what? what did he write on his website that you are saying? Do you want me to read it? I can read it. Oh yeah, sure. <laughs> All right. So there are two songs out, so I'll, I'll just read the thing about the first one, uh -huh. which was called uh, "Get Your Wish." Oh yeah. I mean, the song itself for me is because I strongly strongly relate what he was saying. It's yeah. just that he wasn't super creative saying it. He was just just like laying something down like he just needed to lay something down right right kind of like it. venting almost right yeah he he had to vent he had to vent yeah, yeah. so I, I respect that it's mm -hmm. good that he's making something because it's like either you're making something or you're not making something and yeah. lord knows like I have a hard time making it. right yeah um I, I really liked something comforting yeah that was good I, I thought liked... that was really good yeah I like his kind of like technique of back and forth between uh, the process vocals and the not process yeah, vocals. Yeah, no, I like that a lot too. Yeah, it's really good. Person. Oh no, your voice what? is getting choppy again. Three, oh. Four. Oh. So tell me, how could I walk on water? Oh no, oh no, how it felt, yeah, anyway. Okay, so I, I pulled up the, I sent an email. Get Your Wish mm -hmm. is about finding a reason to keep moving forward, mm -hmm. even if it's not for your own. Oh, okay. I see. Interesting. So that's like the synopsis. I'll like just summarize the paragraph. So mm -hmm. this paragraph is saying that um, he was depressed, struggling in 2015, 2016, 20, mm -hmm. um, three years where great music and then failing mm -hmm. and then getting uh, disappointment. He had no options for a very long time. He didn't know what was going to make him happy. Gradually, he realized it was of it all. Uh, blah, blah, blah. So that's okay. on his website. No, this is an email he sent. Um, oh, but you can find it online. Talking about that, like he he basically had to like learn to tap into that like sublime. As he says the quote unquote sublime experience of music. Mm-hmm. And uh, that kind of 
help to push it. Hmm, interesting. Yeah. Du -du 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 -du. Unfortunately, the human brain is weird, fickle thing. It's super complex and, you know, it does weird, especially given very, very kind of scenarios that evolution has not prepared us for in society. Mm. Yeah. I see what you mean. Yeah, it, 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 your voice keeps cutting in and out a lot too, though. <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, I'm, but, I'm gonna but I mean, I, I heard most of what you said, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let me let me check out. Uh, uh, switch my. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Three, five. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Three. Oh. <laughs> that did nothing. <laughs> cool. Did it do back. Oh hey, what's up? Nice to so meet you. So I can you. actually So like Discord has like network bars that illustrate oh, my connection. Oh yeah, okay. Separate from like my Wi Fi bars. Mm-hmm. And it was in the red. Uh, oh, yeah, when... that's probably why. So I believe. Um, so before before I jumped on the uh, voice chat, um, I was with uh, Mama Dolphin in the other room. Uh -huh. She's on her iPad streaming cable news because uh -huh. my cousin was uh -huh. actually on MSNBC. Really? Because he is one of our nation's leading experts in infectious diseases, Whoa. and he teaches at Harvard. Nice. Yeah. I'm busy cool. Yeah, yeah, he's he's cool. All all three brothers are some of my favorite people. Jeffrey is the older brother, and then Christopher and Michael are the are the twins. Huh, and nice. uh, I love I love twins. Oh yeah, they're they're all super great. I love them. I love all twins. Me too. <laughs> you love all twins? Um well, I don't know. I haven't met all twins, but I certainly don't have anything against twins. I've only had pleasant experiences with twins. Oh, okay. Cool. Nice. Like Yo, Porter Robinson's that. website is actually pretty tight right now. Really? I feel like like yeah. it's always it always looks like something different. Um, yeah, it's uh well, you know, he he pushes the 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 boundaries of the uh of the interwebs kind of tropes that he's working with, you know. True. It's like what an artist usually does, so uh -huh. a, he's a respectable artist in that sense. Mm. Yeah, he definitely I'm... like. Oh yeah, go ahead, My Billy. Bad. My bad. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. no I want to hear what you gotta say. No, you keep going. I was gonna say something else. Oh, um, well, I'm just finishing my thought then. So I was just gonna say that uh, um, he definitely pushed the electronic music genre in like a completely different direction mm. than what most people would have expected out of the oh, genre yeah. at the time. Like 20, 2013 or 2012 when he released Language and he was like, oh, I really like electronic music, but I'm sick of like the club <laughs> music and I, w I wanna hear something beautiful. Right. And then like, <laughs> he made Language and he made Worlds and it was crazy. Uh, I So when he made Language, I hated it. I, th oh, I thought I it was, it. but but uh, so like here's the thing. I feel like it was just because I I always hated Porter Robinson before he made Worlds. Oh. Like I I really hated his music. I thought it was so bland. I thought it was so generic, and like I I just didn't think he made anything interesting, right? And uh, yeah, okay, the here I, EP. I'm gonna tell you like. <laughs> Like how be how I became a Porter Robinson fan. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be a good Oof. story. Yeah, dude, it's fucking crazy. Like I'll never forget this moment, man. And because I've always hated him. Like, dude, I'm not, I'm not even kidding. I've like before he made Worlds, I, I I thought his music was so bad. I couldn't stand it. A a anytime I heard I saw his name on anything, I just ignored it. I'm like, no, I don't want anything to do with Porter R Robinson. I don't care. Um. So I was at work one day. This was back when I used to work at a, at a, at a um, I, I worked at a bubble tea shop in Princeton. Yep. Yeah, and so I was just working, you know, 
just uh doing it up big time big things your bubble tea thing yeah making some bubble tea and so um so at that job they had a they had a serious radio um so i really love like really ambient chill kind of music you know like i really i've always loved chill wave um i love vaporwave for the same Canada, reasons Tycho, yeah Vapor exactly i love i love very chill stuff just like ambient chill music that's like my go-to right so every time i would be at work i would always put the chill serious radio um and you know i would just listen to that for like every single shift and then um and then one day you know i put it on just like normal and then uh, i hear this song and it's like it starts out really slow it's you hear like the chimes right and like oh sea of voices yeah 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 it was sea of voices and then it very slowly starts to build up right and then yeah, I'm like, like, wow. It's a real ambient piece. Yeah, and I'm that like, was like the first thing he published. Really? Wow, that's so funny. The album, yeah. yeah, so I was just listening, you know, I, I so I'm 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 just working, right? So I have no idea who this producer is. I'm just listening to this, I'm like, wow, this sounds really good so far. And then it just builds up to this like an intensity. And then I'm not joking. I was making bubble tea, listening to the song, and when it dropped, I got chills all over my body. Like, I it, it was it felt so intense, dude. Like, I was really like so shocked. I was just standing there, like kind of freaking out a little bit. I'm like, wow, this song is really fucking good. Like, holy crap, I haven't heard something that like. It's it's really rare when a song makes me like get chills everywhere. Yeah. And, you know, so I was like, okay, this is a really fucking good song. I'm like, I have to know who made this. So I run over to like the the little serious radio thing and I look at the screen and it says Porter Robinson. And I'm like, what? Like how the <laughs> fuck? I'm like, wait. Porter Robinson made this beautiful ass track like I, I, I couldn't like fathom it. I was so like shocked. I was like, I didn't know he was capable of making good music. <laughs> <laughs> and I was just like, I was blown away. And uh, I remember like, I think it was that same day. I, I, I was uh, still friends with Steffi and I messaged her and I was like, holy shit, Steffi. I think I'm a fan of Porter Robinson now. <laughs> 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 I was like, I can't believe this, but like, I I love it, and then I and then like um that same week I listened to Worlds like over and over and over, and like I just couldn't stop. I thought it was so good. Hell yeah. Yeah, I got so into it. But um, yeah, that's kind of how. <laughs> if it wasn't for that song, like I don't think I would be a Porter Robinson fan. Yeah. What song? Uh, sea of Voices. Sea of Voices. Oh, so yeah. good yeah that song really it just it blew me away like so hard it was crazy yeah no doubt no doubt it was definitely like because like i really liked language like i had that same like mm. chills feeling for see I, I didn't like language that much but but yeah hmm. i you know why i liked language because language was um your it was, language it was, Yes, it was um it was vibing off of the off of the tropes that were of like the electronic music industry and that like I really liked dubstep when dubstep was oh, starting yeah, to get yeah, big yeah. Mm -hmm. before before dubstep was like only bro step. Yeah, because yeah. When people think of dubstep like, now it's just bro step. Yeah, James you know, Blake like, used to make dubstep. Yeah. yeah, and like classic classic dubstep, I really like because it's a lot more mellow. Yeah, yeah and it's like... very chill. It's very nice. It's literally right. dub, so yeah. <laughs> yeah, I I liked hearing like the the textures of the of the the bass music because it was like those were textures that you could not hear on the radio yeah. back then. Uh -huh. So like dubstep intrigued me, and then bro step hit the scene and then bro step and electro just really took over and it was just hard hard bass noises yeah, and yeah. like if you if you go to like edm festivals that mm -hmm. it's still the thing really like 
Yeah, so what happened was, you know, Porter Robinson hits with language, and language was very, like, like classic trance. It mm-hmm. reminded me strongly of the first electronic song I had ever heard in my life, Whoa. which was um, uh, Children by Robert Miles. Oh, Rest yeah. Robert Miles. Shut up. Wait, which song? Shut up. Sh- oh, my God, Harold. Shut up. Oh my god, Carol, Wait. how do you- that's the No, song I know what song that is, music. Steffi. I ne- I've never said Dolphin. I didn't know what song that was. Wait, Dolphin. <laughs> Steffi, why are you Dolphin. telling me to shut up? Uh, because shut you're up, like, Carol. wait, what song is no. that? No, like, no, I'm saying what song from, from Porter Robinson. Not Robert Miles. So yeah, ro- uh, Robert Miles, uh, children was i heard it in the youth section of a jc pennies and <laughs> the, they had jc penny like, had good music before oh yeah they were very much leaning into at the time when that song was popular they were really leaning into the rave culture like branding mm-hmm. and like they were like rave culture is youth culture and we're gonna lean into it heavy yeah so it was like all trance music Wait, but and like what song by porter robinson did you say that reminded language, you of that language. oh that that language. song or the whole project yeah Oh, no, okay. just language was just like a random single oh, that okay. okay that was in between the Spitfire EP mm-hmm. and the uh, World. Yeah, album. yeah, yeah. I hated so, that Spitfire EP. Anyway. Yeah, because yeah, it was it was derivative. You're right. Yeah. It was. I mean, it did it well. I think, like in terms yeah, of like, but I, I just thought it was. Music. I didn't think it was interesting at all, though. I was like, this is so boring. You know, like I was just not into it. But yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, yeah, I think it. I think it served its purpose. I don't think Porter Robinson oh, was yeah. trying to break grounds with it. I think it, you know, it is what it is. So you know, I didn't pay much attention to it. And like, he actually played at my at my college before oh, I really? started Whoa. there. Yeah, like the year before I started at my college, like he played, and it was crazy. Um, but you know, he it was the Spitfire age. It wasn't uh, like yeah. it wasn't the the cool world stuff. Yeah. Because um, by then he was too big for my college. Yeah, you know? of course. So, um, yeah, just like I, I found language because uh, Joe Deb is a, a Canadian director, I believe, and he mm-hmm. directed a music video by uh, Amberlin. And Amberlin was one of my favorite um, Christian rock bands growing up. Oh, nice. And... Wait, that sounds familiar, actually. Oh, yeah. M- maybe you'll, I knew you'll them. recognize. You'll recognize some Amberlin songs like <laughs> Feel Good Drag and uh, Day Late. They're, you know, they're pretty, like, they fit really well in, like, the emo alternative scene. Oh, nice. <laughs> so you'll probably, and, like, they, Amberlin got a lot of play on, like, Fuse and, oh. like, the other MTV stations, you yeah, know? Yeah, okay. Um, they got, uh, they were actually on the radio, on, like, rock radio quite a bit with, like, Switchfoot, huh. you know? Oh, wow. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, yeah. That's they, so I mean, Amberlin and Switchfoot, they two were together. I could go on about Amberlin and yeah. Switchfoot. They're two of my favorite bands. But anyway, um, so yeah, Joe Dev directed this phenomenal music video by Amberlin, one of my favorite music videos. Mm-hmm. So I was like, at the time, I was convinced I was going to become a professional filmmaker. So uh-huh. I started looking up his other work, and I found he had just also made language uh, by Porter Robinson. Oh. And I heard it, uh-huh. and I had not paid any attention to electronic music between uh-huh. that time that I was in JC Penny and I was like <laughs> I love this shit uh-huh. when I was like oh, I must have been like like 6 years old or 7 oh years God. old or something like that you know <laughs> and like listening to Robert Miles going like this is the sickest shit but like my mom uh-huh. hates she oh yeah hates electronic music all of it <laughs> really it. all of it that's yeah, so yeah. funny all of it the only electronic music that she likes is um, the. Uh, Why does she Al hate Parsons it so much? Project. Because it reminds her of video games, and video games <laughs> remind her of my father. What? Damn, that's so crazy. That's so intertwined. Yeah. Damn. It is. Like, my mom makes really strong emotional connections between, Oof. like, very separate things like very media easily. And just. It's, yeah, especially events media. in her life. Yeah, damn. Yeah, so if 
if there's anything that is somewhat like related to mm -hmm. like some life event that she had, like it'll just ruin it. Whoa, her that's completely. crazy. Damn, that's so. Sucks. But I, but anyway, um, uh -huh. you know, she hated like the '80s electronic music, like <laughs> '80s pop music, because she associated it with Reagan, and she hated Reagan. What? What? Yeah. She Whoa, hates 80s that's so music, fucking yeah. crazy. Holy the shit. The only 80s music that she likes is I've never met anyone because... that would associate Reagan with, with like 80s pop, but damn, okay. I mean, that's so specific. Yeah, she just thinks like coked up nightclubs and like excess and Reaganism. <sighs> Whoa. <laughs> Yeah, she, she she hated the 80s. It was like a, a firm departure from everything Holy she loved about the shit. 60s and 70s. Damn, that's crazy. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Know, that's Mama Dolphin. <laughs> that's so fascinating. And it's funny because, like, all her boyfriend listens to in the car is, like, electronic music radio. <laughs> that's funny. Does she just deal with it? Or, like... Yes. Damn. That's so funny. She... Well, she loves her boyfriend more than she hates uh, electronic, electronic music. music. So. <laughs> yeah. And also, I firmly implanted as an electronic artist now, so yeah, she's so she like has to deal with it. Yeah, she's like, she's like, yeah, I better not like provoke the the uh, like the a, a, uh, unpleasant conversation between me and my boyfriend and my son. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, wait. So, but, so what were you saying about? So yeah, uh, I was listening to Amberlynn, I saw the Jodeb music video, and then Jodeb directed Language, and I saw Language, and I, I got that chills up my spine, mm. because I was like, this is just like Robert Miles, <laughs> but like, new, it's Whoa, crazy. Oh, really? I, okay, I'm gonna re-listen to that track and just really analyze it then. Yeah. You're gonna, what? Could I just say something really quick? No. So what? like, the reason why I said, I told Harold to shut up, was because I was starting to freak out while you, Dolphin, when you were speaking. Um, because you were like, oh, the one Robert, uh, uh, Porter Robinson song reminded me of this, like, one song or whatever that, like, the first electronic song you said. And then I was like, oh my god, is he gonna say Ro uh, Children by Robert Miles? Oh my god! <laughs> and I was, in, in my mind, I was like, if he says that, I'm gonna freak out, right? And I did. <laughs> and I was like, oh my god. And then Harold was like, what What song? And I'm like, oh my no. god. No. Shut up. It's the <laughs> I was asking him what song by Porter Robinson. Do you get it? Yeah, I get it. Okay. <laughs> But yeah, I just want to clarify why I was like freaking out like at that moment, like really quick, because okay. I was like, that song uh, shaped like my entire taste in music. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. Maybe it you should listen to. Stevie, I think you should yeah. try to listen to to the to language by Porter Robinson then, and like keep that in mind. Listen to what? Yeah. To language by Porter Robinson. Oh yeah. Well, did, did, um, if you like Children by Robert Miles, did you hear the, uh, Virtual Self album that Porter put oh, out? Oh, yeah, we saw him live. Yeah. Oh, Virtual Self? Yeah, yeah. yeah. In, Br in Brooklyn at that warehouse? Yeah, oh, no, yeah. no, we saw him, um, it wasn't a warehouse, it was the, at Brooklyn Steel. At Brooklyn, Virtual Self was at Brooklyn Steel? Yeah. No, wasn't it at the, it wasn't it called Mirage, Harold? Oh, yeah, 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 okay, no, it, it wasn't Brooklyn Steel, it was the, it was called the Mirage. The Brooklyn Mirage, yeah. It it was like an really? outdoor it space, it kind of. Steel because like. Because it looked like a fucking think... concrete jail. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, but it, it's called the Brooklyn Mirage. Yeah, that's 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 where we saw him. Did um that show have the the transparent stage and the lights that were under the stage? No. Uh, you you guys missed the good one. I went to the first one. One of the greatest light shows I've ever seen really? in my life. Yeah, they. It was actually supposed to be at Brooklyn Mirage, but Brooklyn Mirage was like under construction at the oh. time. And they were not on schedule, so they booked the show thinking that it'd be done, and then they had to move it to like a random warehouse. They they literally had to build a venue Whoa. inside of a warehouse, like last. What? Night. That's crazy. Yeah. And I then I guess that's why. 
Um, it's not too hard coming from the industry that I used to work in. Like I see the the wheels that have to turn to make that happen. And realistically, if you hit up any one of the big audio video providers, mm -hmm. like if you hit up PRG, um, uh, PRG VR, which is now PRG, um, Four Wall, World Stage, and you say like oh, I need to, like, build a stage, put up, like, a full PA system, and hold, like, the craziest rave in this warehouse in Brooklyn, they'll be like, all right, here's your quote, um, confirmed by Tuesday. Well, and that'll be it, you know? confirmed by and they, Tuesday. Like, they do it. They have the resources, you know? Damn. They, they especially have the resources in this area because of how many, like, huge, crazy, random events happen in... Uh, the yeah. New York City area, you know. Definitely. Wow, that's so. That's fat. That's crazy. Yeah. So they they did a tremendous job, and I give huge props to whoever his lighting lighting designer was, and also huge props to my boy Ghost Dad, who is Porter Robinson's VJ. <laughs> Ghost, Dad Ghost Dad always does a tremendous job, and um, actually we uh, we met him. At a fucking um, Chrome Sparks show. Oh yeah, I've I, I've met Chrome Sparks. Yo, Chrome Sparks is tight. Yeah. I love his music. No, he's actually a big fan of my best friend's work. Um, Which best friend? So my friend Adam Hillman. He he's like an Instagram or um, he does like arrangements on Instagram, and he's like kind of known for that. And so Chrome Sparks like. I guess like became a big fan of his and then he invited uh him and I to his show in Philly and we got him for free. On. Adam Hellman the visual artist? Yeah, yeah. And he makes like he oh, like arrangements. Like, uh, arrangements of like like objects and stuff. Yeah, okay, I'm like, looking at I'm looking at his Instagram. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so so he's he's one of my closest friends. Um and, and that's just what he does. Uh, that's really sick. I know a few people that would probably are fans of his. Just yeah. Based on what I know, what kind of art my friends like. Yeah, he's got a huge following. Oh yeah, it looks like it. He's got. Yeah, and one, one of those is followers. yeah, one of them is Chrome Sparks. <laughs> oh yeah. And so he like invited us to his show in Philly, and and then I got like a signed vinyl from him. That's so sick. Yeah, it's pretty dope. But yeah. Wait, so Ghost Daddy yeah, works with Chrome Sparks? Yeah, Ghost Dad uh, also VJs for Chrome Sparks. Oh, nice. Ghost Daddy. Yeah. I love Ghost, Ghost Daddy. Dad. He's one of my heroes for sure. Damn. That's awesome. <laughs> I agree. Wow. So, okay, so Language was the first track you ever heard by Porter. Uh, the, like, the first track that made you become a fan. Yes, and I'm gonna link the music video in the music discord so that anybody who wants nice. to go revisit a song from 2012 can. Um, and uh, so after that, you know, I, I started following him on social media, but really wasn't interested in any of his other stuff because, yeah, you know, like we said. Yeah, like, yeah, exactly. It's like, it's different, but yeah. Okay, so you yeah. must have freaked out when he made Worlds then. So he came out with um, Sea of Voices, which I like, oh, yeah. but at the time, I was already listening to a lot of post-rock and ambient rock. So, like, Explosions in the Sky. This oh, was yeah, 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 Explosions in the Sky. Yeah, the album Leaf, Cigaros. I was really deep into all of that at yeah. around, like, 2013, 2014. Uh -huh. So when Sea of Voices came out, I was like, this is nice, but, like, you know, I want to hear what else is behind it. Mm -hmm. I heard um, the first single or the, the, yeah, the first real single, which was obviously Sad Machine. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, um, yeah. And I was like, this is nice. It's it's like a pop song, but it's kind of got like Nintendo 64 vibes. Right. That's cool. Yeah. And then like after that, I got really deep into like some other bands. So I stopped kind of paying attention to Porter Robinson for a little bit. Uh -huh. But then I had, um, I was I was seeing this girl and her name was Stephanie. And uh -huh. she was way into like raves and EDM. Oh, and yeah. like, you know, she would go to like EDC and... Uh -huh and like all the big electronic music festivals and great uh and 
we were hanging out and we were just like chilling we were smooching cuddling and then she was like yeah you should really listen to the whole world's album like it's really good mm -hmm. and i was like i was like yeah you know what i saw some like videos of like his tour uh because he put out like a documentary about the tour oh yeah that's like, right i was like i think i think you're right i think i do have to listen to the whole album <laughs> i i think you're like, right I, I have to yeah. So I, I put it on thinking that he was just going to play in the background and we were going to continue, you know, uh -huh. smooching, smooching and shit. Mm -hmm. And I had to like, I had to like stop. I was like, I was like, wait, 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 wait. hold on. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, stop getting all up in my business. I got to like pay attention to this. This is crazy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, and then like, she was like, she had heard it so many times oh, before. She's like, she, she liked the album. Care. Uh huh. So she was like, I kind of want to get back to smooching. And I was like, nah, no, we're going to listen to this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and then, funny. like, I fucking heard um, the song with the violins. Um, oh. Uh, oh. Porter Robinson, Spotify. Um, oh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, yeah, it's called. Um, Fellow Feeling. Yeah, 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 fellow feeling. I, Ooh, that sounds crazy. That. Yeah, I heard that, and I'm pretty sure like I shed a tear, and oh, she's like man. looking at me like, <laughs> "Jesus, are you okay?" <laughs> and then like, and then goodbye to world. Oh right? yeah. And Oof. I'm sitting here, and I'm like, I'm like Stephanie. I tell you, I think I just heard the greatest album of all time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she was like, okay. <laughs> okay, loser, not fucking weirdo. A fucking... <laughs> it was huge, because it was like, it no, was ripping true. right off of the language vibes with like the mm. big... Yeah, fellow nice feeling is... Textures. Yeah, yeah, it does have that, but it's really intense, you know? And then it like... Oh, God. Yeah, yeah Goodbye to a World is so good, too. Oh, man. Yeah, it's a really good album. Definitely. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, Steffi. Yes. Have you ever listened to that whole album? Um, what what album? M Worlds by Porter Rabassa. Uh, I have actually. It's oh. been a really long time. Yes. Mm, what do you think about it? Um. Uh. I don't know. I I'll be honest. I feel like I'm kind of like fifty fifty on that album. Yeah. That's fine. When when did you um listen to it the first time? The whole album? Was it when I showed it to you or like Uh Yeah, it was when Harold first showed it to me. Mm -hmm. What around what like what year was that? God, when it first came out, like Yeah, yeah, because like, yeah, I was obsessing over it. I was like, damn, this is crazy. Yeah. That's interesting. See, I could see why anybody like who would start listening to it today would be like meh old news because yeah. if you listen to any of the songs that's not fellow feeling or goodbye to the world, <laughs> like those two songs have really uh, like held their own. Oh yeah, the, definitely in the landscape today just mm -hmm. because they're so epic. Yeah. But, um, like really, I think we have worlds to thank for future bass as a genre. Cause like, I, see, I can I, see what you mean. I don't think that there was really anything like that until Worlds. Damn. Like, there was, like, bass music, and there might have been, like, melodic bass music, but I don't think that there was anything as, like, bright and uplifting that we see in, like, the uh, in the future bass scene. Like, you know, now we have San Holo, we have Flume, oh, Marshmallow yeah. makes some of that stuff. <sighs> um... Those are like the big future base names, but then like we got tons of like Monster Cat, like almost the entire Monster Cat genre is now on to future base and like Monster Cat, you know, uh, Kawaii music, like Kawaii oh. electronic music. Yeah, like in Moe like, Bass, Moe yeah, Pop. Yeah, Moe Bass definitely has, you know, Porter Robinson to thank just at least for making, you know, United States audiences yeah. more appreciative of those sounds i see what you mean it was like it was like a cool a cool bro dude who was like everybody should just get in touch with their feelings and everybody was like <laughs> like wait uh, yeah i guess so yeah, yeah that's a great idea <laughs> and then and, boop, boop, yeah. boop, 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 boop. oh yeah boop, 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 boop. 
Booty, booty, booty. Um, Years of War, so good. Yo, do you know who's one of? The, so do you know the band called Last Dinosaurs? Last Dinosaurs. Yeah, they're actually nope. one of my all-time favorite bands. Um, very good band. But um, what the, should I listen to? Well, um, oh god, Domino. Are there top five songs are oh domino yeah what's domino um it's it's just one of their their songs it's really good domino, domino. um no, actually uh hold on w what are their their top five songs i can't even find domino their top five songs are oh there's dominoes it's a single mm -hmm. um Apollo 11, Zoom, Italo Disco, FNU, oh, okay. Dream, L Sen, Listen Tonalu, to Zoom. Zoom right. and then Domino. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, the, the, and they're really good. I'll post them on the uh, music thread too, so okay. anybody else who wants so to. So, just a fun fact the lead singer of that band sings backup vocals in, in Years of War. Oh, no way! Yeah, yeah. Mm -mm -mm, years of war. Yeah. Yo, Billy. Are you still here? Yeah. Ha have you ever listened to Porter Robinson? Uh. Did he do that song you sent? It was like a new song you sent to me kind of recently. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And you hated it. <laughs> yeah, I didn't really like it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's fine. Yeah, you kind of have to know like his past in order to kind of like appreciate it, honestly. Especially for that song, because it's like, yeah, it's like it's 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 like in too deep. Yeah. Wait, 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 hold on. Oh my God, Saint Pepsi did a remix. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, Saint Pepsi remixed <laughs> a, a Last Dinosaur song. It's really, it's really uh, all the worlds are are, in, are interconnected. <laughs> Okay. Yo, Harold. Huh? When can you help me get Ableton on my laptop? Oh yeah, so Dolphin can help us. <laughs> uh, it's okay. I don't yeah, want to yeah, I here. can help. Um, no, nah, I mean it's so you just gotta download Ableton, and then yeah. Down, download the trial of Ableton Suite, and then tell me when you've downloaded it and then installed it. Yeah, basically. Oh, no, actually, no. I think. I think you have to download the actual, like, not the trial, like, just the actual thing. If there's a way to do that. But... I'll just post the link. Okay, cool. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Because, <laughs> um, I'm using Soundation, and I'm actually, like, really frustrated right now because, like, I have so many... It's, like... It's, like, after you hit, like, a certain, uh, like, number of, like, channels, like, audio channels, and, like... Just in general, like different things, like the freaking thing doesn't work anymore. So it's like I press play to hear my progress so far, and it's just super sputtery. Well, yeah, that's annoying. Yeah, like I'll play, and it's literally like I'm like, oh, I wonder what do I have so far, and it just goes, uh, 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 and I'm like, okay, this is how you make music. <laughs> this is how you make the music, ah. Uh. Música maestro. Hola, sabías que soy demasiado uh, boricua. <laughs> yeah, so uh, sign up for the trial. Try the trial. You have it for 30 days, and then if you run out, um, hit me up. Oh, thank you. Thank you so That's much. what's up. That's what's up. Oh, damn, Delphin. I forgot to send you the links for, for the pound house. But oh well. For what? For Pound House, uh, episode two. Oh yeah, I couldn't do my homework. You didn't send me the links. <laughs> oh well, I'll send it to you <laughs> later. Um, wait, uh, wait. So, so uh, Billy, have you ever listened to anything else by Porter Robinson? You, you just asked me that. <laughs> no, but I, no, but besides that, that song. No, I haven't. That's it. Yeah. Damn, that's kind of racist. Yep, but I remember how I found out about OPN. Oh, how did you find out about One Oh Tricks Point Never? Uh, cause I it was in high school and 
it was like right around when Garden of Delete was coming out. Oh, Ooh, whoa. good one. And uh, and like Dan Lopatin did like this weird thing where like Daniel Lopatin. Yeah. It's actually Lopatin. It's Lopatin. It's Lopatin. I, Pat Chennington says it's Lopatin. I believe him. Yeah. That's I, true. No, no, no. If you hear the Safty brothers say his name, that's the Safty brothers. They say Lopatin. Maybe he like he's just gotten used to it. He's like, I don't no, care. No, no. He it in even in a like um that short documentary where he talks about the uncut gem score. Uh -huh. He said he introduces himself as Dan Lopat. Really? Oh, all right, all right. I'm gonna listen to it right now. I got the documentary pulled up. It's by um Moog Music, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm pretty. I'm pretty sure he says Lopatin. Lopatin. All right. Let me listen. But, Let me listen. Anyway, he he was like he did this thing where like he invented like a fake band. Oh. Like called like Chaos Edge. Yeah, yeah, he was doing a lot of crazy. Wait, like what year was this? That was probably like 2014 or 15 or so. Uh -huh. And like there's like this whole like Chaos Edge website. It's like super crazy. It's so cool. But cool. yeah, my friend Keenum my friend from high school Keenum. Oh yeah. Was about all that and so i found that and i listened to replica so that's how i found it oh yeah replica's crazy <sighs> replica's like oh my god i just realized that uh fucking the weekend and one of the tricks oh, never yeah. won snl yeah, yeah 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 that's right yeah i had no idea i saw that yeah that 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 shit was crazy yeah that's i we're living in a whole different world now I mean, they're a great collab. I would yeah. say, like, yeah, definitely put those guys together. Damn. <laughs> yeah. You have Uncut Gems to thank for that. Thank you, Uncut Gems, for that. Thank you, Adam Sandler. <laughs> thank you, Papa Sandler. Papa Sandler saved my life. Oh, that's like he's got the... Oh, he's got, like, mad uh, Tycho vibes. And... Oh, yeah. That's definitely a much more palatable texture for like pop music is like Tycho. Oh yeah. So I true. could see I could see why one of tricks would want to go with that instead of the very uncanny kind of like Yeah, do we you know, sound fonts. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I still think his best project was was Echo Jams. You know? Cause just... Oh yeah, I actually I actually found out that he was making Echo Jams as um, uh, Pad Chankton just made a video about it. Mm -hmm. The very first Vaporwave song was actually like oh, another, yeah. another Daniel Lopatin uh, yeah. alter ego in 2009. Yeah, it was called Sunset Corp. Yeah, yeah, yeah Sunset mm -hmm. Corp. Yeah, that, that that was like technically that was the first Vaporwave like song ever. So shit's crazy crazy ass shit going on over here you feel me that's some cool ass shit that's what that is <laughs> I'm, I'm surprised that um wolfenstein did not make more of a point of highlighting that song as like being out in 2009 in the vaporwave documentary wait who so um, oh Wolf oh the the little like essay thing yeah, Wolf, Wolf like the video. OSX. So he made this, like, if you look up, like, what is Vaporwave? Mm, yeah, on yeah, yeah. YouTube, it's one of the top results. Also, Adam Neely made a video mm -hmm. on Vaporwave. Um, Vaporwave. Mr. Amazing made a really good video. His yeah, graphics I, I, are tremendous. I've seen all of them. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah, I just forget the names of the people that, that make them. Actually, Wolfenstein's documentary is now, like, completely buried. Oh, really? Wow. That's so crazy. Yeah. Where is it? It's gone. Pat Chennington. Pat Chennington's all over this search result. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, he's crazy. I'm surprised that you never heard about him. Heard about what? Did you know about Pat Chennington, like, like before the show? Oh yeah, I knew about Pat. Oh, Jackson. you did? That, uh, I mean, that was one of the reasons that I uh, 
that I've responded to your when you were like, hey everybody, oh. you were in the fleet Discord, you were like, hey everybody, I'm playing this show, and I saw it, and I saw it was you, and I saw Pat Jennings, and I was like, <laughs> Oh you're like, my god. You're like, wait, and, okay, and, um, I don't care about Harold, but Pat Jennington? Whoa! And, <laughs> well, it was you, and it was Death Dynamic Shroud, oh, yeah, and Pat yeah. Chen- Like, it was like, I'm like, holy shit, that, like, that couldn't be, like, a cooler show to go see. And at yeah, that point, yeah. I was like, I was like, oh, but wait a minute. Like, my fa- one of my favorite parts of seeing uh, oh. Death Dynamic Shroud was, like, their their custom visuals. Like, I oh, thought they yeah. were... Mm-hmm. So I was at that point. I was like, "Do you have a projector?" <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm glad you asked. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad I asked too. I, I would not have enjoyed the show as much without the uh, seeing the Death Dynamic Shroud movie. Yeah, that was also, crazy. I'd much rather be like performing in a show mm. and like than just being there to attend. Like it gives me some. Yeah, no, nah, no, true. I I feel the same way. Yeah. Speaking of which, I wanna, uh, I wanna like lay down like a like a guitar, like a ripping guitar solo. Oof. Uh, on like on a shoji tune. Yeah. That, <laughs> is that something that you? Oh you hell vibe with? yeah, dude! I vibe with that fucking hard as hell, dude. Yo, so are fucking... you working on anything that you um, want, like, want something like that on, or do you? Because like, mm, I'm looking for yeah. excuses to like no, get you know inspired what? and get I creative. I am, I am, I definitely am. I've been, yeah, I've had this one project for like a couple years actually that like, I'm just so picky about it because a lot of it feels so incomplete, and I feel like, um, like I've been working on it for so long just just because like I don't I want it to sound exactly how I want it to sound, and you know, but. But, do you have like um references for like reference tracks that like oh i'm trying to base it off of this stuff or is it more like an idea in your head that mm, you're it's it's a lot of different things like all the songs are like very different but no like i i would love though i would absolutely love for you to just like make up like make up make up some some melody like with your guitar and like just that's d- what i specialize in yeah dude. that's my thing like if you could just do something like just go on it do your thing on it i would love that for sure yeah i'm like i said i'm i'm just looking for excuses to be creative and ways to be inspired and like working with people that i like mm-hmm. like that's such a fulfilling experience for oh, me and i really yeah. like your shoji you know Thank i you, like bro. i like you i like your whole crew i like everybody here yo turn up <laughs> hey. fast life fast life even fast life. billy even Billy. Damn, that's crazy. Do you like me, Billy? Mm, I could take care of the mm, Alright, whatever. You're his boss. You're supposed to Billy's win his yeah. respect, God. Billy. That's true. I, I, that's why I gotta keep a distance. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good point. I can't I can't argue with that. But yeah, I I would love for you to go crazy on a track, man. Just fucking balls to the wall. <laughs> yeah, I like um. What in your head, like, what would like the guitar solo sound like? Do you want it to be like a like a guitar sound font? Do you for want for me to be more in my head? It like would a... sound very very glittery and shimmery, and kind of tropical, kind of like the beach. Actually, because my the whole album that I've been working on, it's called Beach Lust. Um, and it's so like, it has a very beachy kind of vaporwave kind of vibe. It's like vapor beach vibes. Yeah, like a little bit more like um like flaming ghosts kind of. Yeah, it's kind of like that, but like a little more experimental, probably. Yeah. A little more experimental, but like Miami. Yeah, yeah, very much. I have a song on the album called Miami, actually. Oh, neat. Yeah, so so very, like, beach Mi- Miami vibes. Not, I wouldn't say, like, retro wave or synth wave, but, like, more shimmery, beachy, like, tropical kind of vibes. Shimmery, beachy, tropical vibes. So, like, like, um, like, I, I have, like, a, a, guitar font that like i'm really fond of Mm -hmm. that actually comes with ableton suite um and i just i just modified it by just 
uh, just taking it in like like eighties chorus, like mm. chorus pedal, mm-hmm. to give it to give it that shimmery mm, you know, yeah. pop tune. I bring down the distortion a little bit, unless I'm going for like a strong lead. You know, if I'm trying to make it like a more textural, I, I just dial back the distortion and, and uh-huh. just let the let the let the chorus bleed through. You know. Damn. You 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 are one smart smart dude. Nah, nah, nah. You just I got just a lot of ideas. ideas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <Goodness>. nice. <laughs> we finish each other's. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's, we should stop doing that with the uh, Verona Crisis. <laughs> Wait, what? Stop doing what? You know, with with the whole uh, Torrentines. Wait, with the whole and the. The the social distancing. Oh oh yeah. Wait, we should stop doing what? The, uh, sharing your sandwiches. <laughs> uh, I'm confused. <laughs> well, we finish each other's sandwiches. We should oh, stop doing. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah yeah, that's right. You're right. Yeah, that's not safe. I'm like, come on, Harold. Yeah, I'm kind of <laughs> slow. You're so close, Harold. <laughs> All right, here's the thing. All right, secretly, I'm a little naive. All right, it's a secret of mine. Don't share that. I'm a little naive. Okay. Anyway. Yo, Harold, how on earth did you utilize, like, foundation? Oh, yeah, dude, it was a so huge long. pain in the ass. When did you use that, Harold? Back when I started making Years Beach ago. Lust. Actually, a lot, a lot of the demos for Beach Lust, I made them on foundation. So, yeah. Which is crazy, because it's like... Yeah, it, it, Beach Lust... Uh, uh, foundation's really bad. I forget how bad it is until, like... I have to use it again. Like it crashes like all the time. Yeah. I just got I just dealt with it. I was just so driven. I was like, fuck it. I I don't care. But then it's like you can't I don't know, like because whenever I've tried to make music like on it, like it's like you can't even hear your own song half the time. You yeah, know? you just gotta I'm hear it in your head. Time. You gotta hear it in your head and just know what it's gonna sound like and then boom. I mean, like, I could visualize it, but, like, wouldn't I really be better to just... <laughs> nope, like, that would be worse. Like, yeah, you know, I could be like, okay, that looks like a sound. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I mean, here, like Stavid, kind of uh, just like think about DJ. this. Imagine if you were in the 80s right now, and you wanted to make what you're making right now. The technology I mean, that like, you're yeah, using would be incredible. Me, but we're in 2020, we're not in the 80s, Harold, so... But, well, to me, we're always in the 80s. Yeah, she kind of has to be expected to follow, like, modern standards of production and not 80s standards of production. Mmm, <laughs> no, I mean, that's, like, it's not what I did, and look at me, I turned out fine. I mean, yeah. I, I'm still a little naive, but, you know... I mean, to be fair, like, I mean, like... Being able to kind of just put like a song together, just looking at like the wave forms, like on the thing is like kind of helps with DJing. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, it feels like DJing. Like just also, be- I got I gotta say, riffing off like this and what we were talking about like the other day, like hmm. if something's not fun, it's not fun. You know, like you can't convince somebody to have fun with something, you know? I can. And you can't, yeah. and you can't like rationalize very easily that like, I'm having fun if you're definitely not having fun. <laughs> I'm having fun. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Does this it's, look it's like a Vanessa lot of Hudges? Mental gymnastics to convince yourself you're having fun. I'm having fun. I'm having fun. Hey, I like that. I'm having fun. Yo, Billy. Yeah. Are you having fun? Yes. Nice. That's what I like to hear. Billy, what's the most fun thing that you could ever do with your free time? Draw Vanessa Hudges on Animal Crossing. <laughs> <laughs> you Quality. forgot you were doing that. 
I gotta say, it really looks a lot like Vanessa Hudgens, right? <laughs> it does, right? This like, are you pulling like a guy? Yeah, I yeah, am, dude. It's it's gonna look super like realistic. Trust me, oh, it's gonna look crazy. Um, okay. Uh, so where was I? Oh, okay, nine eight. It's hard though. Like I'm telling you, like this is pretty difficult. Uh. Okay, here we go. So you wanted the difficult, so not really. Not oh, really. I thought you wanted one that was like a, like a portrait. Yeah, I wanted a portrait, but I didn't want it to be hard. I want it to be easy. Oh, you could have done Larry the Cucumber. Though. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, you could have done Larry the Cucumber. <laughs> it's so crazy. From, from Bible Tales. Hell yeah. Veggie Tales. Veggie Tales. <laughs> Yeah, Stevi has a plushie of Larry the Cucumber. Yeah, That's cool. I'm looking at it right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's, a, it's a crazy I little think, plushie. I think freaking Reliant K did like a cover of VeggieTales. Really? <laughs> Whoa, that's a dope. Uh, I love Reliant K. Yeah, I used to be obsessed with them, especially that one song. Um, and I'm and I'm hoping to dun, 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 I'm hoping to be, be my, my escape. escape, yeah. And I'm ready to, I'm ready to. It, did your mom like that song, or that band? I mean, my mom. Yeah. No, she only really likes Switchfoot. That's it. She oh doesn't like Ariel, and she doesn't like Reliant K. We she likes were meant Switchfoot, to be so much more yeah that's my favorite Lost song himself. not not kidding that's my all-time favorite song. whoa are you serious damn that's yeah, crazy I, yo i played with them i told you to do that right wait what no you didn't yeah, tell me that i played i played with switchfoot in 2013 what the fuck what what why <laughs> that's crazy yeah. because i i learned how to play mandolin because i was a huge switchfoot fan and john foreman played like a really interesting mandolin he's like hey you want to come so join I was us like yeah that's literally what Whoa, happened oh that's crazy he saw he saw me in, in a park uh, before the show and recognized me and was like but how did he recognize hey. you because like, i'd gone to like all the oh shows my the, god that's the, so since, funny like, 20 since like 2009 i'd been what? to like so many switchfoot shows that's crazy so for four years, I just went to all the Switchfoot shows, and then he was like, like, hey, I know you. <laughs> Do you want to... Wait, so you were playing the mandolin? Well, I had it on my back because, like, there was a period of time where, like, I didn't go anywhere without a music instrument because Whoa. I was just playing so much music at the time that I was like, I just better have something on me. Damn. And, uh, you know, he was like, what do you have on your back? There's, It's actually, like... The, that wow. meeting is on YouTube. Like I can, I can pull up the the video Whoa. where he where he says like, because they had a, a documentary crew following them. Which what? Oh, oh my like, god, that's crazy! I would love to see that. <laughs> wow. The only problem is that the only video of mm -hmm. the actual performance, mm -hmm. like they whoever owned the video like deleted their YouTube account. So oh. like. You can't see the video anymore, but I'm... You should have downloaded it. ...the video before the... Yeah, I thought I downloaded the video, but, like, all I have is, like, a gift that I made of the video. Oh, whoa, that's crazy. Damn. It was great, too, because, like, they invited me on stage to play mandolin. They were like, okay, you're going to play mandolin for the encore, and we're going to call you up, and then you're going to play it. Whoa. And I was like, cool. So they were like, yeah, don't lose your mandolin because if you don't have a mandolin for you, I was like, okay. And then they brought me up, but like, we had not discussed that I also knew all of the the backup uh, harmony parts oh for my that God. song uh -huh. because me and my sister used to sing that song together. Oh like, my God! Me and my sister used to be in a band and we covered Switchfoot songs. <laughs> So like I knew the parts and then they were like, they were like, uh, we were all on stage, you know, we start playing. I didn't have a mic, oh, but I whoa. just started, I just started singing uh -huh. the backup parts when they came. Whoa. And like, I like scared the keyboard player. Cause he like, 
was right next to me and uh-huh. he was not expecting it. And then all of a sudden I like just start singing at the top of my lungs. <laughs> and he's like, he's like, oh Christ. <laughs> but then Ooh. they like, but then like John, the, the lead singer, he like brings the mic to me and he's like, oh sing this line. <laughs> like, ah! Whoa, what the fuck? Is this uh, yeah, allowed? It was, you no, know, it was not. <laughs> <laughs> that was not allowed. Um, definitely one of the best moments of my life. And actually, like, I had, like, a little existential crisis on the subway going home. Because, like, I was like, this was my life's mission. What do I do now? <sighs> do it again. That's well, I, I set a new goal. <laughs> I wasn't really... I was like, well, I did it, and like, you know, that was that. I got what I wanted, so I was like, mm. what do I do now? <laughs> Damn, that's crazy. Wow, that wow. Wait, so were they your favorite band at the time? They're still my favorite band. Wow. Damn, dude, that's that's incredible. Yeah, You're so it was, lucky. Uh changed my life really did damn i i can't imagine that like i'm trying to so my favorite band of all time is vampire weekend oh yeah so like i'm trying to just imagine like i'm trying to put myself in your shoes like meeting like my favorite band and like performing with them that would be just something else oh yeah in that fuse video that i'll i'll pull up Mm -hmm. like you could tell that i'm absolutely like <laughs> doing my best to keep my cool but on the inside i am just like, like i'm screaming ah! there's fireworks i'm like oh, oh my god <laughs> damn that's crazy i can't i really can't get over that i can't imagine like experiencing that it was crazy another part that was crazy was like the whole band was not together Mm -hmm. but they i guess the band had agreed that they were going to meet in the park down the street from the venue before the show to Mm -hmm. like have dinner or something okay and because like it started out with like two guys and then like the whole fucking band shows up (laughs) now they're all watching me like audition to play the song Uh like on my mandolin they were like get it out play the song What? That's crazy. Wait, that so like something that would be like how old stuff. were you? Oh man, I was uh, I think I might have been like nineteen. Damn. Wow, that's crazy. It was definitely one of the crazier moments of my life. My God. <laughs> so wait, so you, you, so he just happened to just come up to you and just like, like where were you? Well, I, I like waved to them because like oh. I saw them and I was like I was like oh shit that's Switchfoot so I like I was like and eh, they're probably like really busy I don't want to bother yeah, them yeah. like it wasn't like they were meeting fans they were uh-huh. they had a camera crew they were like walking through the park so I was just like hi and then they were like they were like oh, oh. hey let's talk to you and I was like oh god I'm gonna be in the dock <laughs> <laughs> whoa and then no you were more than just in the dock. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, wow, that's 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 a hell of a story. Yeah, it was, Are it they was crazy. considered a Christian band? More so now than ever. They originally they were signed to a Christian label, and um, then they were like they got signed to Sony. Oh. Uh-huh. Like we want to make you more secular, so like be more secular. Yeah, be more they secular. Were, they were cool. They were cool with it because they were right off of that Mandy Moore movie. You yeah. know, the soundtrack for the Mandy Moore movie. Mm-hmm. And um, and then around, I guess, like their eighth album, mm-hmm. they were like, they were like, you know what? If we're honest with ourselves, we love Jesus, and we're gonna <laughs> we sing about love it. Love Jesus. Let's get it. <laughs> <laughs> We love Jesus. Go. <laughs> <laughs> That's a really good Switchfoot impression. All right, guys. Hey, guys. Um, we're Switchfoot. We're gonna we're gonna play some music because we love Jesus. Go. <laughs> Switchfoot is just one guy. He doesn't play any instrument. He's just like, we love Jesus. Go. <laughs> <laughs> What? 
hey, if anybody else wants to do uh, contemporary Christian rave music, like I'm 100% Yo, down. Let's go. 100%. <laughs> I want to I want to be like lasers in church, you know what Dude, I'm saying? Dude, hold on. Wait, it's going to be you, me and Billy and Steffi <laughs> and we're going to be the uh, raver Christian music. Oh yeah. yeah. We're going to Oh my god. We got to get our shuffle on, you know. Yeah. Wait, what did you say, Stevie? Stevie, yeah. Oh yeah, no. Uh, uh, what should we call it? Back in like the early 2010s, I was trying to find like Christian like electronic music. <laughs> and I actually did find some. Really? Oh, yeah, it does like, exist. It's crazy. Yeah. Cause like, yeah, that's awesome. I don't know. I was like really hardcore into like Christian music during that time period. Yeah. And. Oh my god, I was like, oh, I want to listen to electronic music while worshipping the Lord. So, <laughs> while worshipping like, the Lord. <laughs> yeah, like, the... Oh god, oh god like, I, I, I have to find it, hold on. Okay. There is a very controversial rape church that, like, that's their thing. Oh, wait, I think I've heard oh, of them. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you're right, yeah. Wait, is that rap through Jesus? No, no. Rap through Jesus dot com. That that was no, a prank. Raptor Jesus. Raptor Jesus? <laughs> yeah. What? Wait. I, I it's don't, a really I don't think I know old me. <laughs> oh wait, I do remember that. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's very old. Holy crap. Raptor Jesus. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Okay, it's slowly looking like Vanessa Hudgens, right? Very slowly. <laughs> oh, shit, it actually is. <laughs> this, I'm, t I'm telling you, man, this shit's wow. really hard. Oh god. Okay. Um. Hmm. I hope people are still watching. There's probably nobody watching the stream. Oh, there's like. Okay, well. There's three people, but that could be just... I, I don't know. Whatever, it's fine. Okay. Um, Whatever. Probably like all of us. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, well. Whatever. Oh, well. Okay. Damn, I'm like slowly finishing Vanessa Hudgens. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> Did you like that, Billy? Okay, now that was epicness. Okay. No, I gotta say that was legitness. That. Thank you. I know it was. But I appreciate you reminding me. <laughs> Vanessa Hudgens. <laughs> Yeah, apparently she she apologized for like what she said. <laughs> yeah, but the virus. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, good times. She's right. She do we got a point. Saw the uh, the viral clip of the um uh the the partiers on the beach in Miami. The who? The the party guy that was on the beach. Hmm. That was the big like news clip of, of today was this guy being like, Hey, if I'm gonna get the coronavirus, I'm gonna get the coronavirus. I'm here to party. Oh, I heard about that. Yeah. Well he's great. But I didn't see it, no. I just like heard about it. Two, three, four. Are you uh brushing your teeth, dolphin? Yeah, you already know. Nice. Gotta That's really keep good. these uh, chompers healthy, you know. Hell yeah! I'm I'm glad I'm to a, hear. I'm at a floss now too. Well, you should do that, uh... you should do the dance move. The dance move, the floss. Yeah. While I'm flossing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If if I had a floss pick, I could do that. I'm I'm using like regular, you know, uh, non shred floss. For anti shred floss. Anti shred floss. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Alright, I'm starting on my bottom row. Nice. Again. 
special inquiries to dolphins flossing. <laughs> If anybody uh, has questions about my uh, uh, dental routine, you know, I might have some later. Bailey, do you have any? Not right now, but I'll let you know if something mm. comes to me. Okay, good. Don't forget. Oh man, this one at Sahajans is so hard. <laughs> oh god, am I gonna finish this in time? Oh. <laughs> This is hard. Spinner Sajids is so hard. Oh. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> okay. Uh. Okay, okay. Don't worry. I feel like the only reason no one's watching is because everyone's playing New Horizons now. So it's like anyone who would want to watch this is like not going to watch it. Right. It's pretty late too. Mm, it's not that late. We need to do a a, a clip show. <sighs> What's that? Like uh like just make like a like a clip version, like we extract the uh, best best segments and publish them. Oh, like like the highlights of the stream? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, clip highlights. Mm. Nice. That's a lot of work, though. You need to hire somebody to do that, really. <sighs> oh. Nah, it's okay. I can do it. Actually, I'll just hire Billy. <laughs> okay. Okay, Billy, could you do it? Yeah. Find the, the... If you, if you, like, if you delegate, like, sections of the stream, like, like, Dolphin, you cover, like, the first 30 minutes, and, like, Billy, you cover, like, the second, like, we could probably, like, tag team a clip effort. Mmm, -hmm. mayo. <laughs> I guess that could be possible. I don't think it's worth it. <laughs> yeah, probably not. <laughs> you get a point. Three, four, one, two, three, four, eleven. Okay. Like I said, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not that smart. I just have a lot of ideas. Yeah, true. I mean, I think you're pretty smart, though. But. Whatever. Oh, thank you. Uh, I think I'm smart enough to floss my teeth. Mm, I'm not gonna argue against that, but sure. <laughs> I feel very um superior about my uh, dental habits. <laughs> really? Oh yeah, yeah. I, I used to have OCD, dude. I legit had OCD as like as a kid. Um. Like, and I would brush my teeth, like, f like three or four times a day, just because I was so scared of going to the dentist. Um, and also because, like, I was, I just felt really inclined to, to do it. Like, I felt like, it, it was definitely driven by fear, but, like, uh. yeah, <laughs> but, like, dude, I was, like, every time I ate, I had to brush my teeth. Like, it was pretty bad. <laughs> Um, yeah, I mean, <laughs> dentists probably love you, you know. <laughs> yeah, but I was, I was definitely like dealing with something in my little child mind. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, good times. I feel you. Back, um, I used to have like really bad, uh, like hand washing, um, neurotic like kind of behaviors, mm -hmm. where I remember like when it. The, the two life events that really triggered it was first I I was a little kid and like I, we were in a McDonald's and like I put my hands on the floor for some reason like oh. I like I I like was picking something up or I fell down or mm. whatever and then my mom like she got really loud and she was like she was like what are you doing don't touch the ground the ground's dirty especially McDonald's <laughs> it's so dirty and I was like I was like oh god so like that made me in my you know little baby brain yeah. think like well if that's dirty what else is dirty oh and then, my like, god and then um in middle school i saved up enough money to doing like chores huh. um to buy an ipod so mm. i bought an ipod nano and um mm. i remember being extremely proud 
of mm -hmm. my uh, all my hard work to earn it because like I did not get a lot of money for yeah. chores because it was kind of like we were just expected to like yeah you, know, you, you help around the house you contribute to the household mm -hmm. um, so I had to do a lot of extra work and I got it and I was like this is perfect look at this Apple product it's pristine in this box brand yeah. new and then like I had it in my pocket and I'm showing all my friends at school I'm like look at this shit it's so great <laughs> and then and then it was it was domino's it was domino's pizza day at oh, school no. you know domino's yeah, pizza yeah. friday Ooh. and i i ate the pizza mm -hmm. and then i was like that was good you know wiped my hand off again mm -hmm. and then i and then i picked up my ipod and i realized that like i left really mad greasy pizza finger fingerprints Ooh. on my ipod uh-huh and from that point until like most of the way through college, wow. I would like wash my hands so much oh my that God. like they would get like chapped and like bleed and Jeez. shit. Jeez. Oh my God. <sighs> just from not like I would scrub my hands, yeah. but like just the frequency would like make them chapped mm. and, and yeah, kind of dry. Really it would probably would dry but them I, out a lot. And anything that was particularly, like, anything that had a smell to it or anything that was, like, especially greasy mm -hmm. bothered me, like, extra. Ooh. And it still does, but, like, I've kind of curbed that behavior yeah. for the most part. Wow. Yeah. That's so, that's, that's trippy. It's so crazy that when you realize that, like, that you have this, like, tendency to, like, do something, like, repetitive and it's like because i remember like when i was a little kid and like um i didn't think anything of like my ocd tendencies because i mean i didn't know that it was ocd you know and yeah. like my, my parents had no idea that i was going through this you know it was just me and like um i would like have this thing where like whenever i, ha I touched a surface I had this really strong feeling like I had to touch the entire surface, but I wouldn't do it because like I knew that that would be like really dirty. Um, right. But like I had this urge to do it, like and like it would bother me a lot if I didn't do it. Um, especially so like when I would like wash my hands or like brush my teeth or something, I did not like to touch the sink. <laughs> Because, oh. because I felt like if I touched any part of the sink, I had to touch the whole sink, you know? So I... What do you think motivated that uh, impulse? I, I don't know. I feel... I think... Now that I think back of it, like, as an adult, I think it could have been because at the time, um, I had just moved from Guatemala to New Jersey. And I couldn't speak English. Um, and I was, like, very... So, I, as a kid, I was very, like, outgoing. <laughs> And I really like to speak to people, you know? But then when I came here, I couldn't talk to anybody because I couldn't speak English. Um, uh, uh. So I feel like that had something to do with it. Like, now that I think back on it. Because that was a pretty stressful, like, time, you know? <coughs> yeah, but uh, that does sound like it would affect you and in, in, affect your, your, you know, human brain in weird yeah. ways. Yeah, for sure. And I was just like, I feel like maybe I felt like I had to control something, you know, something like that. Yeah. Maybe. But, yeah, that, that definitely, that, that could check out. I'm no psychologist, but yeah. like, I see the logic behind that. Yeah, I feel like it had something to do with, with that. But yeah, it, I, I like, as a kid, you don't think anything of it, but like now that like as an adult i think back on it and i'm like wow i was like really going through something you know yeah oh absolutely yeah it was crazy but yeah <laughs> but yeah big sheesh from me huh big sheesh from me sheesh big old sheesh ah sheesh <laughs> totally owned gamestop midnight release is cancelled <laughs> oh no well, yeah, I'm just gonna go to Walmart, <laughs> like, in the morning. Also, fuck GameStop. Yeah, fuck GameStop. That shit sucks. Do you sucks. guys know about, um, Camelot? Oh, YouTube? yeah, I, I watch them all the time. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The Camelot Man, 331. Always... Yeah. Crazy. Yeah, he, he, he talks a lot about Amazon, too. 
Yeah, he does. I, and that scares the shit out of me because, like, one of my close friends works for Amazon now. Yeah, I mean, as, do you know where he works? Like, is it a fulfillment center? Or if it's. It is. Oh, yeah, fulfillments are, are bad. Yeah, you don't want to go there. Um, totally owned said, and also they're just going to let everybody who pre ordered it come tomorrow, which is a fucking high risk of the coronavirus. Fuck GameStop. <laughs> yeah. That's true. No, fuck GameStop, yo. Billy loves GameStop for some reason. I don't know why. Yeah, you do. I, you know what? After uh, GameStop and EB Games kind of like bought out Funko Land, mm -hmm. I kind of checked out. Oh, they bought out Funko? Or they, like, it turned into. I don't know exactly what happened to Funko Land, but we could probably Google it. Hmm. Man, that sucks. <sighs> God, this is so hard. This is gonna take forever. What if I just finish this tomorrow? <laughs> can I save this? I'm about to. I'm about to see if I can save this. Yes. Okay. Yeah. I. I, I saved it. What should I call it, Steffi? Uh, call it. Inevitable. Okay, how do you spell that? Huh? What? Inevitable? Yeah. It's spelled I. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Wait, A V L? Inevitable. Yeah, you said A V L? A B L E. A B. I N E V I. Just write I N E V I L -E. and then put table. Oh, table. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Yeah. Wait, wait. Why did you want me to name it this? Because what she said over the coronavirus. Oh. <laughs> nice. Um. Wait, how do I edit like a pattern that I Oh, okay, hold on. Yeah, I get it. Yo, wait, so totally owned. If you're still watching, did you pre order a physical copy or did you get the digital version? Let me know in the comments section below. Okay, here we go. I just realized that I, I, I didn't really eat yesterday. Didn't you eat at my house? Yeah, that was it. Oh, wow. Well. Yeah, I'm kind of hungry too, actually. Uh, Alright, I think I'm gonna go save the game. And it's still raining. Wow, that sounds beautiful. Oh, thank you. It's a song I'm working on. Nice. I like that. <coughs> You're a dolphin. Um, have you ever listened to the music by Billy? The music by what? By Billy. Oh, Billy's music? Yeah. Grape Arch Victor? Yeah. 
Um, only what I heard at the show, and then the what I whatever I found on SoundCloud the right before the show. Mm-hmm. Nice. Oh, so you listen to? Yeah, yeah. I I think that's it. In Bright Billy. What, what, what was it? Like your stuff that's on SoundCloud. Uh, I mean, there's a lot of stuff. There's like old stuff. Oh, uh, really? Okay. Oh yes, this, this suspense music is is the album. I'm gonna have to listen more closely because I was in a big rush those couple oh, days. Oh yeah, that's show. right. Yeah, for sure. All right, well. Yo, my favorite song from a Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, piercing Pagoda. Yeah. Oh yeah, Piercing Pagoda is a really good song. Oh, big headache, but I'll be okay. What did you think of 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 the live performance, Stevie? Yeah. Oh, it was pretty it was interesting. Mm-hmm. Like, um, I thought it was really good, especially with, like, the visuals and everything. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And did you like my, my singing? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, that was, uh, the whole live stream. Thank you, everyone who, uh, watched, and everyone that joined. I hope you all, uh, had a good night and uh yeah just thanks okay everybody here is so tight many many aquatic blessings yeah Bring aquatic boy, blessings yes, dolphin you. screech <laughs> i don't know if i should stream tomorrow should i i don't think so right because like why well because the, the the so my whole thing was like i was only gonna play this until new horizons came out Oh, you're not gonna do another? You're not gonna do more streaming? I know I, I could do more streams, but what if I play Jet Set Radio Future? <gasps> yeah. Yes. yes. That could be better, right? I have it. I have it for Xbox. Oh shit. Yeah, and I have the Xbox, so. I can, you're gonna make me jealous. Ooh. I've been trying to find parts for my skates to make them look like his skates. <laughs> Wait, have you ever played the game? Um, I played the original Jet Set Radio on oh, Dreamcast. What? Whoa, that's crazy. I've yeah, only... back in the back in the day. Mm. Yeah, that's that's so cool. No, I've only seen it. What? Well, like my friend has the game. Um, for, for, for the same thing, but, um, like, I've only played it on his thing, but, like, I've never played the whole game, though. Or Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah do that. Alright, so tomorrow we start JetSetRadio.com. Woo! I'm gonna rollerblade while we're doing the stream. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, guys, here, here's the end of the stream. Uh, say goodbye to YouTube. Goodbye, YouTube. Bye, YouTube. And goodbye to Animal Crossing from 2001. It's, it's been a fun. <laughs> it's been a it's been a hell of a fun um uh um series. That's a word. A fun series. Of, uh, May it rest in peace. Rest in peace. <laughs> That reminds me of like Rugrats. <laughs> Same sense. From Rugrats? Yeah. <laughs>